yeah. drinking too. You drinking too? Did they hey, get, auntie. Is that like the wheelchair special? You only get that drink if you're in the wheelchair? You got you to let your skirt down. I, I, I see it. I see it. Yeah, that seatbelt got that little puss out. You better put that little puss up. That motherfucker up. Hey, don't put it All up. Right. They'll put it up. You she already know. That motherfucker she, fat. She can take a dick too. She can. She don't feel nothing. Go ahead, keep fucking. I'm oh, you crazy as hell. You think that little pussy don't work? <laughs> she, she can't walk. But if you rub that clit like this, both legs look like this. <laughs> Crazy, nigga. You know how many niggas heard that one? Like, I did get a hand back fat. That's the nigga part right there. <laughs> yeah. And we just playing with that shit. That shit went through the roof. And just thinking we go in there and get serious for about two hours. Let's do it. I need to. Y'all got studio in the back? We do it after this. Nigga. You want to ride over there, right? We, we need one of them ghetto anthems. Shit, you need to do it together. Year. We could just drop a sum in one. Oh, just drop one sum in one? Just sum in one. We drop one to talk shit in the, in the, when it hot outside and one to talk shit when it cold outside. Hey, that's it. Look at Mariah Carey. With that she Christmas come out shit. Man, that bitch, that song been out 25 years. Man. Every time it goes she at the, least 2 million streams. She spike. the only person that they let write a new Christmas carol. You think about that? Yeah. Exactly. Everybody got a Christmas song, but she got a legit Christmas carol. <laughs> nah, that deep. A carol. Niggas ain't wrote no carols out here. <laughs> you probably don't. You get paid for a Christmas carol like you would Man, if it's niggas, a original. Niggas doing money good. Man, that shit every season. Niggas be doing good. Just to get a jingle. <laughs> hey, come out with a carol, man. <laughs> oh, this on your face, a carol. A carol, man. So, bro, what you do? You a rapper? Hell no. Make so carols. No. Make I'm carols. <laughs> It'll get no bigger than that. Let me, let me go ahead and see these folks got some juices. Take it straight, say it. Mike got, what, Capri Sun? No, I love it. What a Capri Sun? I just need a cup. I'm gonna take a shot. Here go your cup. Okay. What that is, that tequila? This shit got ice in it. It's an empty nah, cup. Nah, yeah. I just poured this ice off that. It's, you want this ice? Some of this nah, I'm saying I did that. Yeah. Well, you don't want to get one of them goddamn. There you go, bro. You should yeah. just pour it in the top. Yeah. Go ahead, go ahead. What's the, we'll start in a minute. Make sure everybody's acclimated. Count it down. What's been going over there at Big Fact, man? You trying to figure this shit out, man. What you mean? Y'all got it. Uh, I need to put 13,000 people in there. I'm, I'm, I'm motivated different, bro. I see that shit, bro. Yeah. Right. Right. That's big, bro. That shit right. big, right. bro. Right. Right. Huge. But nigga, but nigga act like y'all ain't see the 2,000, the 3,000, the 4,000, nigga. They, they really act like they didn't see the 250. What 250? The 250, that's when we started. You got it. Yeah. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. But the nigga don't see that. Nigga see it like, yeah, that shit cool. I came to one. But they act like I was in the back. I was like, yeah. it don't be till you see that. Bro, that shit look like Drake finna come out. <laughs> he talking about that shit look like. Astro World. <laughs> hey, I was looking at that shit. Hey. Came out. It was seated in the And then the motherfucker with the spotlight all the way at the top. Somebody had their phone on all standing right next to him on the ceiling. I was like. Yeah. And the lights was up. And they had their cameras up. Like niggas finna come out there and really perform some music or some shit. Yeah. That's different, man. I know it is. That's different. We might be done broke through to the other side. Might, might be. And then that shit looking like some Kevin Hart what? shit, bro. You know, we you might know it is, bro. And I need kicking some G shit on that shit. Man, I appreciate that one. I seen that nigga uh, DC, but that nigga came out that motherfucker West Side. Oh, yeah. <laughs> right. <laughs> like, I told you bitches. Right. <laughs> that nigga was cutting up, hunching the L like. That's what he do. He got a fuck <laughs> for his ass before he go. <laughs> 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 just how he get down. Let me get one, man. I'm going to put Capri Sun in my look. That's real trap shit. Thank you. <laughs> That's how we get down over here, man. Keep it ghetto. Marvin Gaye, uh, uh, other co-host. The coldest picture of Marvin Gaye I ever seen. That nigga look like he kind of disappointed. <laughs> we 
gotta talk that shit today. It's big facts in here. For sure. Can't wait. J.O.N., you okay? Where we at? Five minutes out? Yeah. All right. This shit sound like, like it's almost sad, like it's raining outside. This how you feeling today? It's some real melancholy type shit. Oh, you be making beats while they doing? No. Oh, OK, yeah, that's hard. Yeah, about musical department. That's hard. You know. Shout out to the band, though. Yeah, which one time, King? You got this out of the kitchen? Huh? This, uh, you just, nah, uh. What's happening? Hey, you want yeah. the blunt? It's our L blunt right now. How many episodes of y'all shoot a week? It depends. We usually locked in on like for show Tuesday night. And we just run that shit to you know. I mean, how often y'all be putting them out though? Once a week, twice a week, twice a week. That hard. Yeah, cause we'll do put out the trap episode Friday. What's the trap episode? Like this right here. And then we'll drop some extra content throughout the week. Cause we got another another piece of content called Black Market. What it do though? What is it? The spotlight. Black businesses and things of that nature. People who are doing shit in the community. Yeah, that business shit. You know, try to open the platform up so it ain't just about us. Let somebody else shine. You know, the people who watch this shit, Facts. they want to fuck with who we fuck with. And sometimes they put us up on people that we don't know nothing about. Like, you don't know my partner them? They doing this. So it really just, to, you know, spotlight some talented black folk. <laughs> And then we got 85, where we let the artists come and perform. You know. Oh yeah, I seen that. That shit had the shit on the floor, like. Yeah. Oh yeah, what uh, what, what that is like? Just let rappers, 80 West, what you call it? 85. You let niggas come perform and shit. Yeah, they can, they come perform with the band and shit. So all those three different like three different. Like entities. Yeah. Man, do what you, do what you do. Yeah. Product placement. <laughs> <laughs> we just jumped off the stream, so we're channel 85. Oh, that's what I'm that's an app? All this. That's an app? Yeah, you can go to, it's gonna be in the app store the next couple of days. Oh, it's approved today? Yeah. Channel 85, 85 is uh, in the app store. It's this up. approved. <laughs> it's got approved. Yeah. Yeah, we got an app. Yeah. Yeah. All type of exclusive content, man. Go subscribe to that. Guess how much it costs a month? What? 850. Come on. How much for the year? 85 a year. Come on, man. Is 850 a month or 85 dollars a year? Brandon. Right. Hell yeah, yeah, that's a hell of a discount though. Right. It's well worth it. Cause I got this other show I've been working on, Project Carlos. Well, I just be messing with all the old schools that I got. You know what I mean? I ain't even peep that. Carlos. Yeah, Project Carlos, yeah. And the shit that we I'm on the bitch, I ain't even think about it. Me. He ain't thinking of this shit. Come on, man. What a, what a, what a creative person that no motherfucker Ain't nobody never <laughs> <never> gave me <laughs> shit. <laughs> ain't about to start, nigga. <laughs> ain't about to start. No, when we put up, when we was in yeah, uh, yeah. the they, mm -hmm. they love it. They ain't got start. enough of them, nigga. We need it, it, Hey, I told you what you need to do. What? I ain't put them bitches in everything, nigga. You, you got cars niggas be looking for. A little more time. Your shit ain't never gonna be finished. That's the thing. <laughs> I ain't gonna be finished, man. I got a little more shit to do, too. Y'all ready to get off in here? Yeah, let's get it. That Grand National go crazy. What out there? That's what that is right there. Yeah. Well, it ain't even necessarily a Grand National. It's a, it's a clump. Oh, it's a G-body. Yeah. It's a T-type. Manny Fresh took all the shit off. That's who I got that bitch from. Yeah, I know. I, was, I saw it. It had no badging on it. Yeah. It's fast as fuck. Yeah. You right. pop wheelies in them bitches if you. Give me one more. <laughs> we need one more track before we get in here. <laughs> Jay Owen. All this music sounds sad today. I told you that, um, what's the name? Um, there you go. Let's see your trail. Give me something with you. Feel me? 
Acting like we ain't got some ghetto legends in here with us today. DJ Scream has been featured on over 7,896 mixes. Come on, man. DJ Scream. You said like Big Bang Black dropped one song on you, bitch, and then quit rapping. <laughs> not a album, not a mixtape. One song, nigga. Legendary. Don't know. That legendary shit. That ghetto legend shit. I'm got a triple double, I'm never played again. I'm trying to talk him out of retirement. <laughs> and if you don't know Baby J, Come on. You have never been to the club in Atlanta. Come on. <laughs> Come on. If you don't know this lady right here, you, I'm probably 100% sure you don't have shit going on in the city. Because <laughs> <laughs> she be everywhere. <laughs> I bullshit you not, nigga, oh from, God. from goddamn far 85 as you can go south all the way up to the <laughs> Shit, I done seen it in Macon a few times. She be, she be every goddamn. She be in Guanexa. Come on, man. Guanexico. <laughs> what you got? <laughs> Guanexico. I tell you what, oh, this is the best way to put it. Anytime you see some pictures of some shit or like that done went viral at the club, 80% chance Jade is in the back of that motherfucker doing something. Supposed to. She, oh, she be doing that on purpose. Man, trying to get in the way of the pictures on purpose. <laughs> no. Cap. <laughs> she make sure she in the way of the camera. Man, it'd be like, it'd be some crazy shit. She'd be at kids' birthday party. <laughs> Let no rapper's kids have a birthday party. You see a video on Instagram, she's standing by the blow up house. <laughs> 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 Look, man, if you don't know, now you know. We got Big Max in here with us today. Yeah. In the trail, for sure. You feel me? This ain't nothing but, this ain't nothing but family in here today, man. You see everybody smoking and celebrating, man. Yeah. Y'all got a lot of good shit going on over there. How y'all put this whole thing together? Huh? How y'all put it together? How did Big how Facts did come all together? Man, shit, man, I, shit, God. God, yeah. first of all, yeah. that's it. First shit, of all. Cause it, in the day, I ain't never thought I was gonna be doing no podcast shit. Man, you really, man, you done changed so much. Yeah. Just by doing this shit, yeah, you yeah. really a street nigga who really wasn't on no whole bunch of talking about me. Nah, never. But you opening up and shit. Yeah, 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 this, yeah. Now you letting everybody see the big bank black that we all know. Nah, you know facts. So, facts. Man, big salute to what y'all got going on over there. Y'all be having all the motherfuckers come through there. Yeah. Nah, we, we trying to focus more on that now. Now we just talk, we trying to focus more on trying to help niggas now. You yeah. know what I'm saying? So we want to build the platform up. We just got our first M with Carlos. Come you know on. what I'm saying? Hey. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Boy. <laughs> we went platinum, went platinum with the Carlos episode, so now it's like they fucking with it and we moving on up. We got some big shit coming 2022, so we starting to get like the young hustlers that's buzzing, but they almost there, but they, you know what I'm saying? Yeah. We, want, we want, I think we want to hear the streets to hear them first on our shit. Yeah. You feel what I'm saying? We're going to do the big name when they call, you know what I'm saying? But It's kind of like we want, we want the, our... That's the raw conversation. Yeah, and we want our platform to be like the foundation. So it's not always like the made niggas that you see on our show. You see the niggas that are almost made or that are on their way to being made. So when you look back, you'll be like, damn, I saw them there. Exactly. Type shit. Exactly. I fucks with it. Cause it's like y'all get a lot of niggas that don't do a whole lot of media. Facts. Yeah. Yeah. Y'all get them to come in there. We select, we turn niggas down too now. Oh man, don't do yeah. shit to Yeah, we just fucking with everybody. Yeah, we turn, we, <laughs> we turn a lot of these niggas down, the big rappers and shit, nah, we decline. What make you turn them down? Respectfully. Because we, I, this big fast, I know you gonna lie. Oh, you know it, Cal. <laughs> <laughs> you lie, your whole career's a lie. Right. <laughs> so, Can't what do you want to talk about? <laughs> <laughs> you don't even need Jesus. You got Jesus <laughs> nah, real yeah, shit though. Right. Man, I was watching that Birdman shit. That's one of the most legendary oh, yeah. that nigga ever did. Yeah, he on he on the way to go on platinum too. <laughs> yeah, yeah. He right behind. Yeah. Yeah. Stone was talking that shit. Yeah, Stone was talking yeah. that shit. I love that nigga because he talked like he about to crap. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, he paid on that shit. Wayne gonna always be my son. <laughs> And it don't matter how much money we get. We always gonna have no job. You know that my son too. They all love 
everybody good. I gave, I gave uh, Weezy about 300 million. I gave, I gave him 50 million. Hell, I gave him three, 400 million, and then I gave Nicky 100 million. Me and BG. If that nigga ever had a fan, it's me. Bro. Nah, that nigga fuck been fuck. We been. I'm the nigga number one. I used to like what he say. Rap. I gave all. They all want me to fuck him. I'm just. Then he crazy. Bro, they both been there. I love that nigga. Bro. <laughs> no, you been a bird, you been a baby fan, bird man. You been fucking with him. Man, I'm talking about before the nigga even really was rapping. When, when the nigga was just saying shit. Just come on, the baby mama spit. told me she pregnant. Taking pills again, <laughs> but it's all gravy, baby. <laughs> it don't matter if my children blind, deaf, or crazy, baby. I was like, this nigga, hey, this shit the hardest verse. But I knew that nigga was petty though. Why? Because if you listen to all them old cash money Stop. records, like if you listen to Dig them, it. they all be like, baby, let me get the key to the road truck. Why? This baby always had the keys to them cars. <laughs> and then the nigga left Lil Wayne. Boss B, slow down in the Jag, you lost me. But you know how shit These niggas crazy. <laughs> nigga, you knew that. Why they gave Lil Wayne that car? <laughs> you knew how slow that motherfucker was. But he never was selfish, though. Yeah. Cause that nigga said, my little BG's on the bus smoking cigarette butts. Damn. <laughs> <laughs> they was rich as fuck. He just had bad luck. Hey. <laughs> cigarette <laughs> level, that motherfucker. You're retarded. <laughs> Carlos. Man, I love cash money records. You gonna have oh, nigga in tears in this motherfucker, man. <laughs> Now that you know we older than the story that came out, all that shit makes sense. You listen to BG, he rapped like he was high on some heroin. Oh yeah, for sure. He sounded like mm -hmm. he was about to pass something. I beat that nigga with that ice something. <laughs> if it call me. Don't let that twin don't look right on me. I stay close down all through the week. <laughs> I'm fucking with them niggas. Nah, for sure. Lock. Y'all got some shit in the in the vault that y'all ain't dropped yet. Some shit that might be too hard for the street. Nah, hell nah. We letting that shit go. Really? We got shit in the vault, but then we that shit coming out. Yeah, yeah we let yeah, yeah, that shit got no fly. guests come through that motherfucker. You like we can't put that out. Yeah, we can't say their name. Though. I, I wasn't gonna ask you their name. I, ain't, I definitely wouldn't ask you their name. Yeah. A couple of them. It was it was what they was doing. They was. It just nah, wasn't it. it's like it's what they didn't did do. do. They kind of like what made the interview do. like. You just fell back. Hell no. Nah, Damn. Yeah, they ain't do what they were supposed You gotta think, like you said, big artists, facts. Who you hadn't seen in a minute, when you come through our shit, I ain't trying to toot no off. They start back getting booked and shit. Cause we help the people see they side of what they trying to say. Yeah. That's what we be trying to do. So a lot of niggas be like, oh, I ain't no such and such out there. Even y'all book. You start having motion out the big fact a little bit. Yeah. Yeah, you know, even though, you know. He didn't start having motion, Jay, don't start that. Nah, he started yeah. having motion, you feel what I'm saying? Like, it was trash. <laughs> like, Stormy came out of blue, his shit went everywhere. Then he went back, he went back in, you know what I'm saying? Yeah. Like, nigga went between the shit, that shit was all over the internet, like crazy. Cause like I said, he ain't one of them ones that's, that do a whole lot of media like this. Yeah. yeah. And Don't be the one. And y'all had him on there, he was good and talking. Like that, that Kanye shit. shit, man. That nigga just took over the world with that shit. Yeah. But y'all do Cause that. he talked. <clears throat> yeah. You get a nigga on your shit and talk, bro. This shit gonna go up. Right. Boy, Kanye was saying some shit on there, man. He was saying everything. Kanye and Jimmy, now nigga trying to take a lot times. of that shit back too. He, like he want them niggas to say all that shit he think about. It. Like I should have said that. <laughs> Let me call Jay Sean. What is it like? What is that? Uh, nah, Big Sean. Sean. Big Sean. Sean. <laughs> they said Jay Sean. Who the fuck is Jay Sean? <laughs> Who about three Jay Sean? <laughs> that nigga waiting on the call right now. <laughs> Say my name. I'm back in it. I'm back in it. <laughs> you know Jay Sean? They gonna be at the studio. <laughs> Come on. Hey, lemonade song. Remember you brought me up. <laughs> <laughs> Hey man, keep my name out of the book. I know. You rappers be sensitive as hell. Mm -hmm. Yeah, that shit be crazy.
can't talk shit. I was just finna add this nigga question. What? So what you like more about this media shit? <laughs> I was just finna add this nigga. Like, 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 <laughs> now what you like more about this media shit though, for real? I like that it can get places that you can't put it. it you like the media going. over the comedy? I'm saying, even with the comedy. This mm, media, that's a good question. The media will land wherever the fuck it wants to go. You don't know who might see Overseas. It. This shit might pop off in Brazil. You get doing yeah. it, and then that brings people from wherever. Yeah. Japanese TMZ. Yeah, but you never know. The these that you drop, they don't go to the same people. Because you don't yeah. say the same thing. Some of these clips do a million, and some of the shit that you thought was going to do a million, don't, don't do shit. Don't do like shit. Like a wood. Yeah. You get what I'm saying? Passive. And they don't uh, stop discovering. Like, cause them shit sit up there. Right. So it's motherfuckers that a motherfucker come on a new one and they'll go back and watch all them. Yeah, bitches. cause it's like. Yeah. And they not just gonna watch it, they gonna put more people onto that bitch. They yeah, gonna like. We got a, yeah. um, a clip from the interview that we did with 21 where he was talking about. I think what he was talking about when he was trying to pay back Jay-Z for, you know, when he got caught up with all the stuff or whatever. And we did that interview like over a year ago, but like the uh, the clip of the Jay-Z shit is just now going viral like this week. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. it's everywhere now. Like, but the interview was over a year old. That should be crazy, like. What if you were trying to pay Jay-Z back and he really wasn't paying you no attention like that? Like you standing there waiting to give him money back. <laughs> he won't even really look at you because he know that you're trying to give you like you're trying to give him money, but he don't want you to do it. And so he like, wait, you <laughs> 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 he just looking at you from the side of you. No. <laughs> what dude doing, man? <laughs> what he doing? <laughs> I don't you know. think he, I don't really think he tripped Like, do you think he, he would, I mean, I know he probably wouldn't take it as an insult, but do you think he would probably just kind of be like, the fuck? Yeah, I think he would probably be like. <laughs> what? Nah, hell nah, <laughs> nigga taking that shit as a gesture, like, still taking this for what it is, like. No, like, I know it's mad respect on it, but I'm just like, do you think he's thinking like, nigga, are you crazy? He probably don't even know nothing about that no more. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> that I did. Yeah. That was a tax write-off. What if you, you trying to pay him back? And he's like, what you talking about? <laughs> <laughs> oh, God. Shit, he, of course he does. Bean oh. finna be different, but he get Bean, Bean get that money. Shit gonna be different for Bean. Watch how these niggas jump on that man Man, dick. fuck that money. What about that stock? I'm talking about the money yeah. first, cause the stock, I don't know how many, that can he get that, that COD in his pocket? <laughs> <laughs> Pull them things out. I'm, I'm nervous for him. Me yeah. too. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Cause Me Beanie's too, still like, in the hood. Beanie still be. Not no more. <laughs> not no more. He gotta leave, he gotta good. go. 50 million, he might buy that motherfucker. The whole hood. He's a, he, you know a hustler be behind in this shit. Nigga be grinding yeah. for so long so when you catch no up. He ain't got them 50M back. Not that shit, every nigga feel like. I feel yeah, like I'm a hummer in my hand. Yeah. 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 He ain't 50 million Now what I'm saying, he's so far behind. But he, and in the hole for shit that he want to do, yeah. he finna fuck up a dime of that money. Oh, that's what that. I'm saying, like, oh, yeah. He deserves it. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. He like, deserves it. Like, nigga, trying to spend a million, taking, 10 of this I'm money now. Right. That nigga finna put today. myself back yeah. on. What the fuck yeah. is you talking about? Yes. Yeah. I'm the coldest nigga yeah. in the rap game. I got 20 million cash. I'm putting all my old shit back out. <laughs> everything coming back out. Yeah. What are you talking about? The richest I'm finna drop huh? everything yeah, out of recording before I had this money on my record. Well. So he'll be the richest Philly rapper ever? Nah, you can't count Will. Will, Will Smith. Smith. Will Smith. Now, outside of Will. Will Smith is Will Smith. Like, that still, shit don't even. He's a Philly rapper. Street rapper. Well, street rapper, street definitely. Street rapper. Yeah, you can Philly say that. Rapper for sure. Don't me? try to act he like got me, me. Smith wasn't no street nigga. He'll have him, he'll have me <laughs> beat if he gets that what? That nigga wasn't a guy. And that five. Y'all trying to say the rapping version of Will Smith wasn't a street nigga? He was street rapping. Shit, you better go back even further than that. I don't know now rap nigga that had a song about fighting Mike Tyson, nigga. That's some gangster that shit. That street shit. That nigga is a that gangster. That is a fool. He went comedy, head to head man. with Mike Tyson. That was comedy. All right, man. Get on in there. Don't ever see. discount the comedy, nigga. Every, yeah. every little bit of comedy yeah. got some truth in it. It yeah. might have been Mike Tyson, right. but there's a nigga that could fight. 
Yeah. You think you think what's your name you trying with though? Who? Jada. Man. Yeah, let's get into this. No, no, no. Don't get into oh, that. Not on me. We just sold out of Reno, nigga. We, we not can't. doing that. No, because we don't know what the fuck might happen. What? This might just, they might be setting us up for What about days. opinions? I'm just saying opinions. In your honest opinion. How it, see, how do you see it? Like, damn, mm. oh, shit. It hurt. Mm. The real nigga, it hurt. It hurt as a man. Yeah, because I looked, I thought that was the nigga that got away. The what? nigga that, that made, and when he did that shit all the way right. Now I ain't got nobody to look at that did the shit all the way right. What if he's still working inside his finesse though? I can't mean, give up that Will Smith face for shit. I don't even know I'm gonna let her act shit. like she doing this, but I'm doing this. I don't and even know if this shit real. This might be part of the new Facebook metaverse or some yeah, shit. This That's what I'm saying. Oh, Shut up, nigga. <laughs> 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 I didn't even think, think this might be the greatest the movie. This might be the greatest <laughs> movie we ever watched, nigga. I don't know. In a huh? I don't know. <laughs> right before your eyes, like a live movie. I don't know. I you think we watching a live movie? Like, I ain't never seen no shit. <laughs> it ain't even being filmed. That shit crazy. Like me personally, though. I feel like it's kind of like some, like stranger in my house type shit. This the thing about You can't it. say that. You don't know what's going on in the phone house. I don't no, know. That's what I'm saying. I ain't... No, but from the outside looking in, it's like, for her to say the things that she said, and then for him to have done the Oprah interview and say the things that he said. What did he say? Like, I don't want to quote it because I don't, I, I don't, I'm not exact, but he's talked about certain things like discussing stuff with her. But that's like some shit, if y'all are a team and if y'all are married and if y'all are together, that's not some shit that outside people are supposed to know. But this is the thing, I ain't never made Open money. I ain't now. never made no money off an argument with my girl. Yeah, them books selling behind that shit. Both of them money. See, that's what I was saying. Yeah, I, if, I, if, I make, if I could make money off arguing with my girl, I would best believe we well, got some episodes. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I don't care, bro. I got some movies. <laughs> shit, <laughs> y'all want to buy some arguments? But if that's the case, then they're not in a marriage. They're in a business agreement. That's what a marriage is? You Who buying arguments? What kind of I need to say to this? <laughs> you pick any one of them. Okay, yeah, say them first. Who buying arguments? Anybody want to argue? Me and Shante got plenty. <laughs> For real, I'm gonna tell it all. I don't care. This shit is normal. Huh? I, I ain't never seen them act this normal. Who? The, the Jaden Will? Yeah, this too normal. They probably playing for the big bag. They really showing us that they still hood a little bit. Mm. Shit ain't never gonna be all the way right. That's what I'm saying. It's, it, it was you see that so picture? Old, you see like... that? You see that picture they put the uh, her, the little girl, and Tupac like she even got the uh. Man, come on, man. <laughs> She even got the little girl cutting her hair like like Tupac. The whole family going by like Tupac. You see that shit? <laughs> yes, you did, man. I ain't seen it. You seen it? <laughs> put it up. Somebody put it up. Y'all shit pop up on the screen? Put it up. Pop it up on the screen, you know what I'm saying? Joe ain't doing mean. shit, man. The memes ain't shit. Man, welcome back to the 85. Oh, what a fuck. We ain't even go to the big fence right there. Celebrating the wins of life. The wins. The highs, the lows, and the hoes. Let's get it. Mm. That's how I'm gonna start uh, doing my toast. This is for the highs, and the lows, and the hoes. And the hoes. I like that. That's a player. Because really? the hoes gonna be like, they gonna smile on the inside. They ain't gonna let everybody know they hoes, but on the inside, that bitch gonna be like. <laughs> That's us. <laughs> I feel like hoes be getting disrespected, man, and they like, they so important in the community. You said you feel like hoes get disrespected? I feel like they get left out. How? Because it's like the, the appreciation for what they bring. To the yeah. table. To the table. You saying they get a really? bad rap? Think about it. Think of all the shit that's supposed to be like big events. If all the hoes stop coming, what are we doing? What are we doing? It's just a bunch of fucking regular ass people. <laughs> yeah. These niggas what? again? Again? <laughs> hoes make the world go. Hoes the bring the excitement. <laughs> Even if don't nobody get them, they still was there. <laughs> Think about the best times <laughs> in your life. Oh, he finna go. You finna the run first on this thing one. That you remember is the hoes. Daytona Beach. The first thing when you call a nigga try to convince your partner to come, what you say? It's some hoes out here. Come on, man. 
when you leave tomorrow and, and tell it to describe it to your partner, what are you saying? Nigga, you missed it. It was some hoes in that. Man. <laughs> Man. 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 Then no. And you know what? It ain't never. <laughs> <laughs> Niggas gonna never be like, man, there's bitches in here. No, that's too aggressive. That mean ain't nobody having no luck. Bitches got <laughs> bitches got an attitude. Man, that's for real. Hoes is happy to be there. What? Yeah. Hoes is enjoying right. themselves. Right. Hoes is, oh, I ain't never had right. some rock before. Like hoes is <laughs> hoes is like them <laughs> bitches enjoying themselves. <laughs> bitches got a problem. Um, that's all they got. That's bitches. Oh, yeah. 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 Let's go. When you they put it like that. Casamigos. They don't have hoops in here. Get these bitches no, out of here. No, drinking whatever. What we drinking? We drinking what we drink. Hoes drink liquor. Yeah. Yeah. Hoes drink whiskey. <laughs> <laughs> they drink everything. You ever had some hoes come over here and they drink to everything? They just started on the ground and drunk up all the white. How the fuck they have? <laughs> they hoes be sick, but they hoes, they do this. They don't even get sick. Uh-uh. Mm-mm. <laughs> Fuck two up. hours then eat some Taco Bell. <laughs> <laughs> four hours ago. <laughs> oh, so old man Taco Bell. <laughs> Get it from by the side of the bed. <laughs> Natural soggy hell. Eat all of them. Man. Where that quick touch of shit come from? Quick, hey man, that's some shit I grew up on. That was the number one rule. Touch shit. Man, don't. Was that for the holes or hey that man, <laughs> first week before you leave out the house, hey man, don't be nowhere acting like you ain't got no sense. No home training. And don't be nowhere touching <laughs> shit. That's the best advice I ever got in my life. That's if you ever want to just eliminate a lot of problems, man, just leave shit alone. Don't try to fix it. Don't touch it. Just, just hear that shit and keep moving. Quit touching shit. I got a question. What? Did y'all steal them chairs from a coffee house? No, nah, we don't steal. Oh, okay. No, nah, when the, you know. That's we, Arabic. No, nah, when the shit. <laughs> <laughs> this is <this one. laughs> I've been looking at shit. <laughs> so look, there was a coffee shop around here that closed. Oh, okay, okay. And then we just bought all their chairs. Oh, that's all right. Yeah. That's all right. We been investing in ourselves and shit like that. And we just, we just niggas who can't pass up a good deal. Yeah. Yeah. Have you, okay, speaking of deals, right? Hey, it's Clayton English, man. If you're trying to look good, get you some good outfits, Stitch Fix has you covered. They get you clothes that's personalized to your style and taste and your size. The clothes gonna fit you and fit the moment, whatever you're looking for. If you're trying to lounge around, if you're trying to work out, if you're trying to go downtown, you know what I'm saying? If you're trying to, you know, do whatever outdated dance that you probably gonna do. Go out there and jerk, and you're probably going to tear your meniscus. Stitch Fix Freestyle is your trusted style destination where you can discover and instantly buy curated items based on your style, likes, and lifestyle. And Stitch Fix got you covered. They have you looking good sitting down, standing up. Whatever you choose to do, you're going to be right because the clothes actually fit. The styles for workouts to work wear, for lounging around the house, or for a night out on the town. Stitch Fix Freestyle has clothes for any occasion. Stitch Fix. Clothes personalized for your style, taste, and size. That's stitchfix.com slash 85 South to try Stitch Fix Freestyle. So get started today by filling out your style quiz at stitchfix.com slash 85 South. That's stitchfix.com slash 85 South. Hey man, it's me, Clayton English. I know you, you like me, you probably forgot that one important thing once you got to the house. Well now, DoorDash allows you to order essentials, drinks, snacks, all types of household items within 30 minutes. That's 30 minutes. And you would take longer than 30 minutes because you go out there, then you go see somebody that you know, and then you have to talk to them, and it's going to take way longer. So just have DoorDash do it. Make sure you tip them. DoorDash connects you with the restaurants you love right now and right to your door. With over 300,000 partners in the U.S., Puerto Rico, Canada, and Australia, you can support your neighborhood go-tos or choose from your favorite national restaurants like Popeye's, Chipotle, and Cheesecake Factory. Hey, ordering with DoorDash is super easy. Order on your app. Get what you want from where you want, and then the driver's gonna leave it outside. Contactless delivery. You know what's going on out here. They're gonna have your food wrapped up, and it's a safe delivery drop-off setting. 
For a limited time, our listeners can get 25% off and zero delivery fees on their first order of $15 or more when you download the DoorDash app and enter code 85SOUTH2022. That's code 85SOUTH2022. And hey, order some DoorDash. They'll bring it to you. It's better than going out. That's 25% off up to $10 in value and zero delivery fees on your first order when you download the DoorDash app in the App Store and enter code 85SOUTH2022. Subject to change, terms apply. This episode is sponsored by Blue Chew. Hey, what's up? It's your man Carlos Miller. We are live here at The Trap, and I'm just here to tell you that you can get your first month of Blue Chew for free if you go to the website and sign up, get approved by one of the licensed medical providers, and use promo code 85 south blue chew is a unique online service that delivers the same active ingredients as viagra and cialis but in chewable tablets and at a fraction of the cost that's bluechew.com promo code 85 south if you already know the code use it get the first month free all you gotta do is pay five dollars shipping man blue chew's tablets are made in the usa and prepared and shipped direct to your door in a discreet package Go show up to the crib in a discreet package. Nobody gonna know what it is. It's gonna have your name. You take that. Now you got some blue chew. It's not hard until you get some blue chew. Get it? It's a pun. It's a pun. Y'all don't appreciate my humor around here. That's bluechew.com, promo code 85 South to receive your first month free. Okay. Have you ever been in a situation where. Oh, shit. You, cause this, this shit happens to me all the time. I end up spending more money than I would have planned on spending trying to save. Mm -mm. Like, I'm, I'm going to catch a sale or some shit like that. Well, and I end up buying so it. much shit that's on sale. It's not a I sale. Spend. You ain't never saving money when you buy shit on sale. Preach. That's the trick they get you with. They try to, you save, that's what the ticket say. The right. ticket be like, you save. A hundred, fifty-eight percent, whatever the fuck. You save all of it if you don't buy that shit. You got damn right. <laughs> you got damn right. A hundred percent. shit that's on sale. That's not a deal. That's not a value. This is the shit that didn't nobody want. Because you got to look at how much that shit cost to make. Exactly. And then nobody want this at the price point. So we had to slash it, slash it to that bitch at the outlet. <laughs> Now we trying to get you to get it, but you go get it with some more shit. I done did it too. That's how gay. Yeah, that's Cause you go buy the sale shit, it make you buy more shit. Cause you like this hell. Even if they sell it to you for sixty percent off, they still make money off this shit. So just think of how much they would have made if you bought that shit at, at full, full price. price. How much it cost to make? Not nah, quadruple. Y'all watch goddamn Shark Tank. Oh, yeah, I'm yeah. tell you what they we paying nothing for this shit, but we're selling for this. <laughs> <laughs> I like when new motherfuckers already have money and they can't play them at the end. I don't what like you make last year. Oh, we did four million. Why are you here? Well, I basically <laughs> just came to see if this nigga wanted to be my partner. I, don't <laughs> <laughs> I mean, we good if you don't. We already got Amazon on the line. I want in. I don't even want yeah. no, no, no. yeah. When they got the flag. <laughs> I really don't even like you because you're like let's, let's, with my nerves. So me. I want to see what Mark Keaton says first. <laughs> <laughs> Mark, what are you doing? <laughs> I want to be in the NBA business. I'm trying to get these motherfuckers in Dallas to bring the fuck yeah. they can't talking about. <laughs> Watch the hell out of shit. Try to take that shit. Yeah. White people are amazing, man. I hate how the black dude be getting out so early sometimes. He, he, he mad. Yeah, the niggas just yeah, come in and they be like, so I got a new thing. It's a way to walk your dog. And he's I'm like, out. I'm out. Yeah. I don't like, uh-uh. I've been like, in the dog business. I don't want to be in the dog business. <laughs> Typical nigga. He always get a check, not spend one. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> <laughs> that motherfucker come in. Who, who would you do? Who you think you'll be? Do, you'll do a deal with Ooh, if you went on a like? I want to be a being with that person. Like what type of company? Nah, what person? I'm gonna tell you. You talking about? You based talking about? Off, based off what yeah. I know about yeah. business and what I know about America, that white lady. Which, Which one? one? Laura. The old one. Any of them? Barbara. The one with the blonde hair. Barbara or Laura. Both of them got blonde hair. Give me Laura. The one with the hair, like with Laura. the longer hair? Yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. That's yeah. a business I ain't never did before. What? With them folks. <laughs> them type of white folks. QVC? <laughs> I'm talking about them white people that eat like green bean casserole and shit. Them? <laughs> that month, that type of money? Oh, man. That's their, that's their like. That that's the white that, lady that got that's QVC. That money, that, that's that racism money that ain't even came over into the black community. What she about bring, you, Scream? Cuban. Mark 
Cuban. It might be Lori, because she bring that QVC up. You that QVC. I do QVC. You know he done did some shit. Now your money on the line, you don't know what to do. He ain't <laughs> in the phone. He, 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 he. Mark Cuban. Oh, he did Mark Cuban. That when the camera go off, he like, get this motherfucker out of here. He got a whole billion. Yeah. He ain't trying to. He don't give a fuck about no nigga. He don't give a fuck about these new wave brushes. Period. <laughs> he's one of them motherfuckers that you, he'll be all in your face, and then when you hit him, he gonna play you. Mm. He young, too. He like one of the younger ones. Exactly. Dallas got a whole bunch of games. He ain't about to. So what about that older guy? Mm -hmm. Fuck him. Old oh, white man been fucking Herbie, up I shit mean, for the Mr. Wonderful. Every fuck time him. he came up with something good, an old white dude <laughs> fucked it up. Nobody no. fuck with him, man. Nope. They fuck up everything. This motherfucker asked for a piece of your grandmama song. Oh, man. This nigga, I need 15% <laughs> and where she they gonna be They need to get buried. a black woman on there. No, that's why. They got one now. Who, over? They got one now. New, new episode. Like anybody, like somebody that knows business. She ain't from the U.S. They gotta have some millions ready to get away some millions. You gotta have somebody to be on that shit. That's what I'm saying. There's plenty of black women. Black women, too honest. And they're gonna be saying shit that's gonna be hurting people's feelings. Baby, I, I, I like everything you're saying, but why you ain't putting no lotion on your feet? <laughs> <laughs> you on national TV. With no lotion on your lips. Lick your lips. I'm out. I'm out. I can't even look at it. I can't even look at it. I can't even look at it. I ain't doing business with nobody who don't wash their ass. Who cut your hair? Medea. <laughs> <laughs> mm -mm. I don't like her attitude. Who is next? I don't like how she walked in there like, like that. She walked up. She's too aggressive. <laughs> oh, I fuck with that shark tank. We need a hood version of that, man. You big bang black man, bring that shit together. Brains, bring it Come on, man. That rope band on, we gonna find us. Uh, <laughs> ain't got nothing for these niggas. Come on, man. What do you do? Ain't got nothing for these niggas, man. Man, let's go and do one. Call that shit shark drink, and you gotta pitch that bitch drunk. <laughs> <laughs> I will, you know your business, nigga. <laughs> Get this nigga shot for the young nigga. No, man, you shark put the drink. sharks at the bar and you just keep serving drinks and then people just pitch you ideas. <laughs> shit, I'm trying to goddamn pitch my shit to some nigga. You got a show idea? I got all kind of ideas. For real? Yeah, yeah. I'm on that shit you on. Man, I got some crazy ass ideas. I'm just, I'm gonna do a show about just black women getting their hair done. How that shit feel like? I know how it feel, but I'm saying how it feel to you to like think of some shit and this, and this shit like this shit. How this shit feel? Hey man. Well, this the thing. First of all, I got a dog ass team who helped me follow through with all of this shit. You hear what I'm saying? First of all, like, yeah. I can come to these niggas with the craziest shit and they'll just find a way to kind of like, like we can all just, it's a lot of shit that we do without even saying. You yeah. know what I mean? So that shit feel good to know that they like, they ain't never been like, hold up, man, this shit too too stupid right now. So it's like, that's the that's the magic of it. <laughs> yeah. And I hit this nigga and we we been shoot we been shooting shows for the goddamn <laughs> longest, man. We know one of these bitches gonna work, nigga. <laughs> we been nigga, they had us. We been horses, nigga. Bull riding. What you mean? Sports betting, nigga. nigga trying, trying to get shows to go, bro. Trying to get shows to go. This bruh. a pilot. Who I, you want on the pilot? This nigga. Okay, this is what the show is. We get there, that shit, something different. We to try shit. Nigga, the shit I learned late, I ain't even realize we was doing it, nigga, is fail forward, nigga. Yeah. Fail up. White people do it all the time. They fuck up some shit, fuck up some shit till some shit catch. We look at it like, nigga, I failed. Mm -hmm. My life over, nigga. Like, yeah, you right. You right. Not me. <laughs> See, you right. Yeah. I been too fucked up. Like, you, you but I been too fucked up. I, like, that shit come back from goddamn. Flipping Nick sex and shit, bro. I been too broke. Can't yeah. lay down. Yeah. You lay down, but you finna die. Where I'm from. Mm. You finna keep doing something. Hell yeah, bro. Cause it's hey. like, like, we niggas, man. We grew up in the ghetto doing, we did talent show all day, if you think about it. Yeah. We, we project babies, so everybody got talent. You got some nigga that give up, though. Yeah, hey, that's how life works. That ain't, you can't never worry about them. See, they, they gotta give up. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Cause some people, it's not real talent. Some motherfuckers can just imitate real, real good and that shit only goes so far. If you don't have nobody to copy, then your creativity is dead. Yeah. Mm -hmm.
told you that's shit. why Eminem came out and said, "You whack it in the motherfucker, you bit your staff, huh?" <laughs> <laughs> Real shit. That's deep. Nah, that's real though. You gonna hey. run out? You gonna run out? You gonna run out of material trying to be another nigga? But it's never no material. All you doing yeah. is watching. It's like, say for instance, a nigga. It's like you're a replica. Watching another nigga, he doing everything he doing. At some point, the nigga that you watching gonna blow up so far past you, you ain't gonna be able to see what the fuck he doing. <laughs> and if you blow up, you ain't gonna be able to see other people's shit. That's what be happening. Somebody said some shit the other day that was so real and it stuck with me. It's like every motherfucker that made it is a combination of the people that they was around. Didn't nobody make it by themselves. Damn. Nah, hell nah. Never. Who? Shit. I don't know. Everybody that everybody that's what everybody say on that song. I did it on my own. <laughs> I did oh, it on my own. First thing that they fall out in the, with the rap. <laughs> man, I wrote all that myself, shit, nigga. man. That nigga pussy. Man. Didn't nobody help me? Didn't nobody help me? Man, that nigga pussy hell, man. <laughs> man, man, man ain't help me, bro. Y'all were cool, lady. Them niggas like, ain't do shit for me. Y'all been friends. That night, nigga was ready. I had to get it out the mud. Yeah. Didn't nobody extend the hand, boy. You know, niggas do that shit just so goddamn they can be stingy. You know what I'm saying? Niggas try to find ways to goddamn... Mm. themselves out. The, yeah, like... You know how that shit go, bro. They just, how, they just, they just not even in music, they just in life. Nigga feel like, bro, I don't owe no nigga shit. How? The plan was... <laughs> right. Right. <laughs> the original plan was... <laughs> For us. I said this shit before on the shit. Like, once a nigga go to, all right, that's just like how you just said, my team, I couldn't have did it on my team. You know that shit. But you low, so I'm gonna got now. You, who you is, you the face. But what about my people back here? These folks still gotta eat. These folks still gotta be, they did it with me. Niggas will go to thinking, cause them folk coming to see Carlos or coming to do this shit with Carlos that. Really, I can just put anybody in y'all position. No, the fuck you can't. You no, you can't. Mm -mm. That's too many cooks to spoil your bro. Exactly. Yeah. Facts. Mm. Exactly. Yeah. yeah. Where you got that motherfucker from? You got these bitches coming. Where they at? <laughs> <laughs> Where the motherfucker at? Need some money. You just pull that motherfucker out the plate. I'm in the mix of the day for real. Seven thousand. Seven thousand. I think he had a number about right. Man. He had a number about right. About that seven, seven, eight thousand mixtapes. Seven, eight thousand. Damn, you serious? Yeah. I used to do one every close. day. What's the pussy shit you see the nigga do? You go. 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 Too much of it, bro. You know that. Say that. He just had a little girl too, so you know he different now. He changed. Yeah, he different. Yeah, he daddy. Vibes, so. His voice. Hey man, those guys. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yeah. yeah lies, man. <laughs> we all grew and mature <laughs> in the rap. Game. Anti Cosby, Street, he got a right now too, like. <laughs> I ain't thinking about nothing else. <laughs> Congratulations, my brother. Yeah, yeah. That's what's up. That's all right. How old? Clayton just had Yeah, I just had one too. How old? Oh, congratulations. Yeah. Three weeks? Oh, you yeah, fresh. Right. Boy, I'm older than you with my mindset five. My you gonna shit. be all right. That little boy gonna be all right. My little boy, he good. Shit, Flip Flop just had a little girl too. Yeah. Come on. Chad too. Yeah. Chad too. He, he wants a flip flop to the show one time. I'm like, nigga, you are the cameraman. <laughs> 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 what if they stomp your foot, nigga? What? <laughs> Chad was mad as fuck. <laughs> like, Chad relaxed, bro. <laughs> you gonna get dad reflexes. That shit. What's up? That's where you gonna be. You just gonna be able to jump and goddamn catch your baby if anything look like it's about to happen. You gonna be able to snap up out your sleep like the Undertaker, nigga. Like, nigga, just get up. 
Okay, cool. Make sure this motherfucker still breathing. Like, you, yeah. But you gon' Yeah, cause you know they do them little jerky movements and shit, dog. I don't know. Yeah, 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 yeah. Don't the room. I, I, Babies are durable as fuck. That's what you find out. Yeah. Not these days, though. You gotta these catch them now. I used to be letting mine hit the floor. Uh -uh. <laughs> <laughs> what? Boy, please, boy. Uh, <laughs> Nigga, I, yeah, you, you gonna, gonna, gonna learn. <laughs> Cause I fell out so many times. My grandma bed, he be so happy. I fell out that motherfucker so many times. Boy, beds here. You better learn oh, how man. to fall. Oh, man. <laughs> Roll with it. <laughs> hey, boy. <laughs> I got one. Oh. One son. For real? Yeah, huh? yeah. He about to be 13. It's over for me. My grandbaby, though. I love my grandbaby. There you go. Paul, Paul. Yeah. She's been turned four. She turned four on the 12th. What's up? What's up? I was asking DJ Screen, what's some of your favorite tapes that you done did out of the, out of the stack? Most legendary shit. I always say, um, you know, that shot alone changed my life. Shots from my brother Love. Yeah, Literally yeah. Literally changed my life from when he was joking about me having money since the 90s. That nigga had money in 98. <laughs> <laughs> so definitely that low. You know, that that day and all that done done, all that shit, you still hear that shit to this day. Yeah, for sure. Yes. I come on stage to that shit all the time. Yeah. Rest in peace, Sean. Weird enough, up. Soldier Boy. People yeah. don't know I did this first mixtape. So you were the first nigga to do a soldier boy? Do That's what I was about to say. Oh, oh, man. Soldier boy gonna hit that shit and be like, hey, I did my first nigga. What the fuck did that scream talking about? Nigga, <laughs> <laughs> it was me. I did 11 mixtapes before I even knew this man. <laughs> you didn't invent the mixtape? Oh, that nigga go in, yeah, yeah. bro. Scream? Oh. <laughs> 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 Bro, please don't say that, man. Then I came to the studio and was like, pop, pop. <laughs> <laughs> Nigga, I had a podcast first. <laughs> I came up with this. <laughs> <laughs> oh, my God. <laughs> uh. Shout out to Soulja, man. Yeah, yeah. yeah. First man's oh, time. That boy, Big Draco. Man. He is the new Rick James. Hey man. Oh God. Think about it. You be wondering where the soldier boy go off is. He be like, where that nigga? You like, don't know what's gonna trigger this nigga. This nigga cussed out the uh, video game people. And it was a few hours later. Yeah, y'all, I own the term. <laughs> Fuck them people. <laughs> they can yeah. suck my dick. I was like, man, what is wrong with this nigga? In the same life. I was like, So it's about to be having proof though. He do. He got that. He always, shit. what do this say? That nigga come out with a seat. So it's about to what do this say? Yeah, yeah. Him, I think, him and Orlando Brown are two of the funniest. Well, the post crisis, oh, the pre crisis Orlando Brown. See, two of the funniest that you, The nigga from Disney. That nigga was doing all that in the middle. He was of his doing crisis. a whole bunch of like crazy ass shit, but he was funny as hell though. He got his life together and got his life right, you know. Who is that? I wonder what the fuck Disney is doing to them uh, kids that, that ruin them They so need to bad. have some type of program like. No, they need some adults on adults. What are they saying in between? Hey, listen, you little niggas. If you fuck this up, we're <laughs> gonna punch you so fucking hard. We got one hour to shoot that so way. <laughs> Man. No, I think hey, they, hey, can you move your black ass over there? Motherfucker <laughs> <laughs> sitting in the director's chair with a leather belt. You stupid. <laughs> you know we can whoop you. Yeah, no, you stupid. See who knows their lines today. Nigga. <laughs> what if they just got all them kids standing over I think there? They, 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 they can't read shit. They just all standing over in one corner. That's a raven. <laughs> Come on, let's go, let's go, let's go. Anna Montana, you're next. <laughs> what the fuck is wrong with you? Guys? Crazy. <laughs> they in the hallway waiting. What? <laughs> I gotta pee. Well, you're on deck, so there's no peeing. There's no crying in Hollywood. God damn. No <laughs> kids grow up to be crazy as fuck. Man. They probably Shit. getting too much you see money what though. Going, what be happening to them? How nah, much they, money is too much? Back then, though, they got the kids in charge. Not back then. Ooh. 
Them kids was probably and then them folks fucking their money up and they was so famous and they gotta be grown broke. That shit go make you go crazy. Yeah, yeah. When your parents yeah, take the home alone nigga though, he just Macaulay Culkin. Hey, let me get some of that weed, King. That's parents, that's their parents taking that shit. You think that's it? How much money is too much? That's their parents or whoever shit, parents before them. More than you shit. more than you ever had? Yeah. When you a kid, shit, that could be two paychecks. <clears throat> know what I'm saying? Like I'm we just talking about, about, about beans. Like beans. Yeah. Like we just yeah. said, beans that fit. That's too much money, man. Just to come out the blue. Hey, man, I wonder. <laughs> this is the shit. This is, how, this is how I'm thinking. I wonder how long it would take me to get hungry if I had $50 million. <laughs> when well, you got money, you can take a minute. When you got money, nigga, you don't get hungry. Later on, you know you can eat. Yeah. What? Yeah. Fifty. When you fucked up, you want everything starting at eight in the morning. Oh man. Everything you can get. The city you can't have everything. Like that shit crazy, man. Hell no. Yeah, you'll forget to eat. You got money. <laughs> hey man, I forgot to eat today. <laughs> <laughs> nigga, in regular fun. life, nigga, it'd be 1, one p.m., nigga. That's the Your shit I'm about to pass out. <laughs> you don't even know where to spend that kind of money at. You can't spend that shit nowhere you done ever been already. And nigga don't even know what to do. Like, what do I do? Right. <laughs> like, I can see when you grind up to it, you're gonna know how to kind of do little shit. Man, them athletes be blowing that money. You can blow 50. Hell yeah, yeah. fam. Yeah. They, they are watch. athletes. This is a regular nigga. I got you. All right. Point taken. You saying he is? Yeah, he thinking like shit. He just finna go in crew control. I might woo woo. He ain't think he finna do this. Not 50 no ball. 50. Not no 50. You gotta go. What? Ain't nothing he was doing finna get him 50 million off. <laughs> Not at one time. <laughs> That's what I'm trying yeah. to say. Nothing. You <laughs> probably gonna get him some money, probably living comfortable. There's nothing that I'm doing right now that's gonna get me a whole $50 million dollar check. Yeah, yeah, and this Benny Sigal, he might want his in cash. <laughs> I need to see it. Uh, he might need it. He's like, look, man, I, I gotta see shit, it. Man, ben probably tell this nigga, yeah, <laughs> shit, you, you, you got, you give me some of the cash. You got something on your nail to give me now? <laughs> <laughs> Just make me believe. Exactly. What yeah. you, <laughs> can you order a couple of Put some down on it. See? <laughs> give me him in cash. Don't borrow money from everybody. Oh. <laughs> you know I'm good for that but shit. But what if, what if, what if, what if, what if, yay? Does that Gemini shit and flips back out to be a fuck nigga and don't give him the money? Yeah, he ain't gonna do that. Yeah, he went out there too far. That's a marketing scheme. Nah, no, he ain't gonna do that. He gonna give him. He gonna give him enough that Ben gonna be like, I got that fit to me, even yeah. if he give him ten. Yeah. He I gonna mean, do enough to make it. Ben gonna be happy like he got that money. Cause really, yeah, that, that, stock, too far. that stock probably about fifty million. He might have rolled them bitches hey, into one. historical shit. I ain't, ain't nobody 5%. never just gave nobody a fifty million. Ain't nobody never gave no nigga shit. Exactly. This might be the first time. So he earned it. He came up with the word, but buddy acknowledging it. So we. This might be the first time in history, though, man, that somebody does give a nigga shit. This might change. He the whole do it. Oh yeah. Of course of so me. now yeah. all the billionaires give niggas, niggas money. Niggas might not even be able to say that no more. Ain't nobody ever gay. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> right. Call you ain't even gay. Yeah. 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 <laughs> we had it hard though. We had it hard in the It was rough. We had it hard. It was rough. Don't ever think it was easy. But we good now. Yeah, we good now. <laughs> what do you think? <laughs> nah, real shit. It don't take that much to change a nigga life. You know how many niggas life he could change. I'm happy for that nigga being though. Shit. Hell yeah. Hell he yeah. deserve it, goddamn. Shit. You did something to make it, goddamn. You did some shit, dog. Man. But you did something. Amen. Kanye got them blessing nigga Sunday Amen. service. Every, 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 <laughs> every, every nigga have a moment where it's like nigga some, sh some shit I can never repay you for. Yeah. Yeah. You don't never know what that moment might be to somebody else. Yeah. And then when they get in position to be able to repay you. You could have been the nigga that dropped him off so he could see the birth of his child. Anything. Shit got fucked up. Anytime when, when you came through for somebody. Mm -hmm. Yeah, a Gemini nigga too. He he doing that shit too. Like he could have just he ain't had to do that. He doing that shit too to show like whatever else, whoever else over been fucking beans, whoever else, I just blessed it. But what if it's a business move too? What if the white man pulled him to the side at the party and was like, 
Hey, they're gonna cut your fucking balls off in taxes. <laughs> what do you mean? Yeah, you don't know. Welcome to the billionaires club. What I'm supposed to do? You better give some of that fucking money. Facts. <laughs> <laughs> but still, you could have chose for anybody else, though. Yeah. Fuck that. You still could have chose anybody else. You could have gave that shit to the church. You could give up. You can give away up to two hundred million. Get that fucking shit away. That right. sounds like some white man advice Not off the record. Pay some people. I, I'm telling you. Give back to the community. Hey, bro. You gotta get in your charity, man. Oh, you gotta get in your charity, man. Come on, man. Come what on, are you doing? <laughs> oh. Huh? oh. Bro, they were somewhere that wasn't no niggas supposed to be at. When you got a billion dollars, bro, they come get you and tell you, come on, don't say nothing. <laughs> <laughs> you got a B. But you still chose. Like an M. You chose. Look what yeah. he chose, though. You, you still have chose. You can service and can stumble up on an M, have a great year. Yeah, me and the me and yeah. I was out of style now, bro. Jeez. Them billions in style now, bro. Too many niggas give them. You yeah. gotta have a billion. Too many niggas give them. They creeping up on a tree. They don't want no billion, no, no million dollars. No, no, no niggas want billion. Did you see the Jeff Bezos? What is what? it? He took his lady to something. Hey, don't take her around there. Leonardo DiCaprio, she done jumped in this nigga arms then. Don't, don't, don't take her around there. If she looked, she took. And she was, she was on the hook. I'm talking about she was reeled in. Yeah. Even Leonardo, he had the elbow on her was, He like, man, get your, you know. Bitch, you better get her. Get your bitch, Somebody man. Somebody come get her. <laughs> hey, man, get your <laughs> Hey, Jeff, this, this. Is that your bitch? Like, hey, Jeff, this ain't that. <laughs> Hey, Jack, come get your bitch. That nigga like Pootie Tang. Hey, Jack, you a one-out boy. Ah. Ah, Jeff! Damn it. Ah. Come get her! Give it that. Give it that. this. Hit her you, off me. You brought her here? <laughs> you? You knew I was gonna be here. <laughs> yeah, you, you was a wild boy, Jeff. You wild boy, man. You a wild boy. She he loose. Was, he was strong too. He was like, that's cool. <laughs> 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 then niggas started looking at the program. Talk, oh, let me see what <laughs> Nah, try to act like you don't see that Embarrassing shit. Embarrassing as fuck, though. This nigga got all the money in the world. But you know what you got? And his bitch still chose. He ain't rich as Is I thought white? he was. He ain't rich as I thought he was. No, his wife left. His wife got me and some, I was that rich. Guess what I did before the party ended? A new bitch. A new bitch. <laughs> yeah. She would have just stepped up Me right too. after that. I would have just, and then she would have been. Yeah. <laughs> oh, Dismissed. I'm on some Mr. Burns type. Dismissed. <laughs> Damn, man. Oh, this is, oh, you say they wanted his wife, it was just a girl. Yeah, I don't know if his wife. I know his wife divorced him, and she no, got like some billions. You left. think his wife divorced him? Come on, man. Come he on. got rid of her? That's what you're saying? This, this nigga got all the money in the world. He just gave 15 billion, said, like, leave me alone. He said, what is, he was playing, he was tired of arguing with him. He was like, what would it take for you to shut the fuck up? <laughs> <laughs> he fucked around and got mad too, said a real number, then he wrote a check. And she was like, what does this mean? He was like, what does this mean? Get your shit. <laughs> <laughs> Live life. Yeah, yeah, get the fuck away from me. Man. Oh, oh. I'm just making this shit up. I don't know what the people did, but. I'm sure if you was the number one richest motherfucker in the world, you're not about to come home and argue about nothing. Mm -hmm. Yeah. But, yeah. on the other hand. I don't wanna argue. I'm glad I ain't that rich, I'm petty as fuck. Any but on the other hand, if you had, if you were the richest nigga in the world, and. Anything gonna set me off. You, you know you have like... <laughs> Who the fuck put this ice cream in the freezer? Y'all can have this shit. <laughs> nah, but wouldn't that kind of like... Wouldn't that kind of make you feel... I mean, I'm not saying that like you have to love the arguments or no shit like that, but don't some kind of difference of opinion or disagreement, doesn't that keep the balance? No. 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 Keep the balance. Argue. Fuck the no, I'm not saying argue, but I'm just saying, no. if you got somebody that fucking agrees with everything you say, who the fuck wants that? Me. Nah. 
Me too. Me too. Though. The first in the world. Me too. Yeah. Even if I don't, even if I don't, so so I'm not supposed to have an independent opinion. No, you are. Of you. For sure. No. You can yeah, have. You a, gotta look at me. Get what? Not if I got. A, not if I'm. I'm um, goddamn Jeff Bezos. Exactly. Don't even talk. Cause I want it life. <laughs> I want it life. Shut up. Who cares? Thinking about something else. Shut the fuck up. Shut up. There's too much going See, on. That type of attitude. If you got that much money, you can, you, you you can have a mute person. button. Yeah, I don't care. I don't want to be rich nigga. Turn this bitch off. Shut the fuck up. Don't you talk don't to me. You don't want to be the richest nigga anymore? <laughs> Hell no. Nah. They got other shit to think about it. Talk about. That's what I'm saying. You know what I'm saying? Like, I mean, but that's not fair to the woman, though. I, mean, I ain't talking about no one. I'm talking to anybody. I don't need, bro. Put some headphones on, man. I don't okay. I'm in a old I'm thinking about some more shit. Bro, I got if that I money. I come home and my lady is the richest woman in the world. Right. I mean, what, 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 what am I to disagree about? You'll see. You'll she just see. came home making 99 billion a day, and that's an off day. <laughs> you think she wanna come here like we make the bed up this morning? We need to talk. Is there somebody else? No, no, Stam no, no, Stam no. Stamin ain't giving Oprah no problems. You don't know what the fuck Stamin is doing. Man, he wasn't even got to be Stamin. It's a nigga who girl work at the hospital. She ain't even a doctor. She just a nurse. He he still agree with most of the shit she say. Right. Right. She making 75 before taxes. He tell everybody that he come in contact with. You know, my girl, you know, she's about to be a doctor. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yeah, good. Good. I ain't work for four months. I ain't had to do shit. <laughs> Tell them all I get back. What? <laughs> they take very little to make a man happy. Nah, for real. I don't know, man. That shit, man. <laughs> <laughs> you said it, bro. Like, the fuck are we arguing about? Yeah, we good. We're but argue. money isn't everything, though. Shit. No, but you, you're supposed to. But y'all, no, listen, listen to what I'm saying. Y'all gotta understand where I'm coming from. Please. About. Like, y'all are saying that, like, okay, just because he's the richest nigga in the world, like, Okay, I'm not supposed to be a person. And that's bullshit. See how you done flipped it? See, that's what y'all be doing. Ain't nobody said nothing yeah, about yeah, you we, not being a person. Like, you see that line yeah. said disagree. You still a person. I said don't be it ain't nothing to disagree about. What do so, most, so, what do so, most broke what do most broke couples argue about? Let me see that line. Most broke couples argue about money. Money. They agree on everything. So else. you're not broke no more. What the fuck we arguing about? Right. That's all I'm saying. I'm not even saying, but what I said yeah. before, I'm, I'm not saying arguing necessarily, but I'm like, difference of opinions, like. That's okay, so when you disagree, make your bitch run up on goddamn Leonardo DiCaprio. <laughs> trying to have an opinion. Mm -hmm. My opinion is I like Leonardo DiCaprio. I love him. <laughs> bitch, you finna get about that. It's money. I'm gonna pay that little money, whatever they talking about. Then she gonna ask a weird ass question. I mean, what would you do? Not that. <laughs> it's my favorite. Man. You don't know what happened in the car though. He probably told in the car, look, you ain't my girl. So when we get in here, act like it. And this is you showing up. Nah. <laughs> he posted some shit. She, she, if that's the case, she saw her opening and took it. He's he's an old white dude. He might be freaky like that. Did you see him? You like that? <laughs> <laughs> I told you, didn't I? Probably did. Yeah, his shit might not even work. See, what? you take shit way too far. Man. Every time, man. Oh, you take shit too far. You think that man gonna have all that money and that dick don't work? Come on. They ain't got the best drugs in the world. That shit don't make They probably got the best honey. What that shit them y'all need to be having that honey? He probably got the best honey. Oh, doctor. Man, that nigga <laughs> dick drip. got that nigga dick got Bluetooth. He probably that nigga got a whole, whole, new, whole new package. <laughs> That's what I'm saying. This Balls nigga. and all. Yeah! <laughs> Everything! <laughs> Cyborg. <laughs> Fucking brother put his body in the goddamn thing and they suck all the age off this nigga. You know what I'm saying? What he got? Yeah. You know how much shit they sell on Amazon that we don't know about? <laughs> the life changer. The bitch ain't for 2 dollars What that is? This shit that suck all the age off your body. Dude. You just it's on the leg now and it's like, you, you be in that bitch. <laughs> <laughs> Come out. Oh shit, my butt ain't been this smooth since 96. <laughs> That's the type of shit white people on. Oh my god. We still trying to figure out our Facebook password. These niggas. <laughs> Life changing inventions. 
Mm, shit, crazy. This is some real shit? Or <laughs> you just... Catch you do, bro. You, you do. Talking about this nigga dick don't work. Nigga got a whole doctor staff. Probably a whole hospital just by himself and his immediate family. The dick wing. What? For the hospital. Helicopter Damn. on the roof just in case of an emergency. Pilot on 24 hours standby. No matter sure. where the fuck you at, his car will probably pull up faster than Uber anywhere in the world. Yeah, but real shit, like with that type of money, you can't even begin to imagine the type of amenities that someone has at their disposal. That nigga like probably that been in the sewer and he know about all what a Ninja Turtle stay in there. <laughs> that nigga ain't been all through America. <laughs> like, this is America that we don't even know nothing about, man. That shit is awesome. Yeah, you know all the secrets when you got that kind of money. Yeah. <clears throat> you see how this shit really works. Nigga went to space. What? Who the but they say they just going out there riding by. Them niggas ain't getting yeah, that. Yeah, they just nah, they not getting that. Who you stay with? How about they spinning just riding? Them niggas just going. There. They ain't even going that far out there in that bitch. They going up to the edge and then turning back around. Who who they spend the night with up there? Uh, nah, they turning around. They turning. They ain't even getting that. They just looking at the woman. They walk around and see some shit up there, bro. They gonna run up on one of them ships, them aliens. Like, hey, bro, who called that? Bro? Hey, man. <laughs> hey, man. <laughs> hey, man. Hey, who the <laughs> So they just going, what they doing, bro? They just hey. going up there a little bit. They, they going, going up there a little bit. Uh, one dude got, he got the plane to take him up there. Then his shit took off. But Jeff Bezos shit took off from the ground and went on up there. But oh, he got the plane to take him up well. Oh, he got like up to the upper atmosphere and then he detached from the plane and then he hit the boosters and then he go into the ship. How shoot. did he do that without his oxygen being fucked up? Damn, Jay, you act like he was on the engineering team. <laughs> mm -hmm. <laughs> no, I'm sure they had that shit pressurized. You ain't know I knew that. I don't know that. I don't even know if that's the right word. Yeah, but I mean, he just. They ain't going up there, they ready. It's like if you got that jet, uh, like how the jet pilots be. Yeah, you know how that shit be. He oh, you say they went. So then, how long it take for them to do it? They didn't stay long from what I saw. I thought Elon went all the way, no? Nah, this shit blew up. No, shut up. <laughs> the Tesla nigga. They did have one of them shit blow up. And how did he get out with it? His rocket blew up. It wasn't the shit he was in. Oh, I know. He, went on, he the one that went and got the shit pulled up there. And then Jeff Bezos took off and his shit, this nigga had a cowboy hat on and shit. Riding through space, nigga, some white man shit. Genius, man. He be dropping cars and trucks like George. And he'd show you them bitches and then you ain't even come out for two years. What a Tesla truck at? I don't know, but he can send it to the 85 South Show. I don't, I don't, hey, we'll do a whole show from that. That's, big, but, that's some big but flex and shit. They doing like shit. I went to the moon. Yeah, yeah. The biggest flex. You can't say that. Jeff Bezos took that bitch to the moon, and she still <laughs> acted like that. She oh, went yeah. with me. <laughs> I'm just playing. I'm just playing. <laughs> <laughs> you take a bitch to the Mars. Now, see that? Now, this bitch exactly still gonna right jump out the window. Right. No, tell the truth. Would you <laughs> go though if you had the chance? The moon? Nigga out of space, man. You, you just got a white partner and you're like, hey, check this out, man. We're going up there again if you wanna go. Yo, I'm going. Yeah, I'm going. I have to think long. I'm on it. No, you're going, because you're going in the caves. So oh, no, I'm going. Yeah, yeah, I'm going. I'm going to see. <laughs> I'm going to come back, but I just went to the moon. For sure, you went? Hell no. You wouldn't go? No. Mm -hmm. You ain't even got to, you just going up and coming back, back down like they did. You oh, still would do that? I'm going to get knocked. No, you... <laughs> they going to see what's happening on this shit. <laughs> Hell no. So what y'all think they going up there for trying to see if they can move up there? What, what's going on with this yeah, shit? Why I don't know. They know some shit that we don't know, whatever it is. They know some shit that we don't. No, they don't. You know what they They trying to get away from us. They just going up there having a coke party, coming right back. Nah. <laughs> <laughs> crazy. Uh, Come on, we're going to go on. Nice, you know? Zero gravity. <laughs> you ever had an orgy of zero gravity? <laughs> they think the world going to end. They trying to get up out of here. That's what I think. They know we get them out of here. It's been supposed to end. No, it ain't. But it's not going to end, though. I, mean, I thought it was supposed to end. We so, we're about a, a trillion years away from that shit happening. I don't know what everybody rushing for. The Earth been here. This shit was here way before we was here. How the fuck we going to save it? We live on it. What's up with the COVID shit? Is she gone? No. Shit, we in the green. They say Atlanta green now. Yeah, cause this... Atlanta been green, that's some bullshit. Yeah, we been on go. This some shit that, you know... We been open. We was opening up shit. You saying where the shit go to, like how that shit was just doing... Oh, 
The vaccine slowed down. Huh? Man. Nigga, God love Atlanta. <laughs> I don't know what you talking about. You say it like that, right? You can ask any black person. Oh, they got an Atlanta story. It ain't no other city that they can say that about. Anywhere you go in the world, and you say Atlanta, they're gonna be like, man, Atlanta. <laughs> They had some hoes. Hey, hey, yeah. hey, had them hoes. Hey, had them hoes. <laughs> hey, hey, I'm telling you, man. <laughs> hey, man. Back in the day, me and your uncle, man. Hey, some good times. Tell me, Atlanta just that that spot like that. Yeah. For real. We in this bitch, man. You know who this podcast is for directly? Who? Niggas who watch 85 South Show and Big Facts. Let's go. Ooh, yeah. Yeah, man. Yo. What y'all got coming up for, for the next year, for the new year? A whole bunch of shit. Yeah, we're trying to keep that shit coming. Yeah, yeah. You gotta do it like some rap shit. Yeah, you know, you gotta do it like, gotta hold them songs. Yeah. Like, we got some shit coming up for sure. Trying to definitely get on that tour and shit. For real? Yeah, for I'm sure. trying to open me a chicken spot. What kind of chicken? Chicken sandwiches and shit. Mm. Wings and just all the chicken. You gonna do like, yeah, like different shit, like not just like fried chicken or no shit like that? Nah, we gonna have real chicken too. <laughs> <laughs> real shit. That's what's up. Everything chicken is gonna be chicken salad, chicken soup, chicken noodles. Every, the whole chicken, That's chicken hard. and dumpling, all chicken products. Now see, I come for that. I chicken like dumplings. Chicken sausage, chicken nuggets, and chicken tenders. Mm -hmm. Chicken, we're gonna have chicken tenders, chicken nuggets, and chicken strips. What's the difference? And chicken fingers. What's the difference? Chicken, <laughs> chicken nuggets. Chicken nuggets right. and tenders and fingers. We're gonna have round nuggets and natural size nuggets. What's natural size? Nigga, you know natural nigga. <laughs> You want to put the edges on the bitch. <laughs> what the fuck is wrong what, with this nigga, man? What part of the chicken and nuggets made out of? The breast. You didn't think I knew, huh? I don't know, huh? It's on the breast. What it is? It's that white What's meat. the nipple? It's that white meat. It's the nipple. See, most niggas like that dark meat. And wings and shit. I don't like dark meat. See? <clears throat> I don't like dark meat. Okay. But did you see the shit on Instagram where they exposed allegedly two of the fast food restaurants? One of them, um, they claimed that one franchise uses dolphin meat and then the other franchise uses raccoon ankles for their nuggets. Yeah. I don't know what the fuck, we don't know what we're eating at this point. Yeah, that shit crazy. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that shit crazy. Oh some of your favorite foods probably scare the shit out of you. Just keep eating them. You don't know what the fuck that shit is for real. Cause don't know the food tastes like it used to anyway. It don't. You remember that yellow Wendy's? Mm-hmm. Man, that shit used to slap so hard. Yeah, now it's a faster process and everything. Wendy's don't even taste right no more. Yeah, yeah, bro. You right about that though. Dave was doing them commercials. <laughs> we got yeah. them. this burger. That wasn't even like no fast food shit. That shit yeah. was like a real burger that somebody made for real. Yeah. yeah. Now that shit real. That shit don't even be hot no more. Hey. When that shit to be all beef patty. Hey, man, Dave would get on the commercial and guarantee you that your Wendy's wasn't gonna be fucked up. But Dave was basically telling you, on me these bitches good. <laughs> I own these motherfuckers and I eat here every day on, on my daughter. That's why I named this shit after her. <laughs> Oh my daughter. <laughs> nigga, Wendy's was so good. Check this out. Yeah. This shit was a fast food. What are those food. Ain't even the same. Ooh, it was fast food, man. What a buffet in that bitch. What other fast food place would you eat a fucking buffet in? They had that salad bar. When, when did they have a salad bar? Come on. Yeah. Man. Yeah, they had a salad bar. Yeah. Your auntie Damn. want to file a lawsuit right now because they took the salad bar out. <laughs> Damn, man. Oh, 
Anyway. We was fucking with Wendy's the long way, man. The Wendy's was like with the soggy fries. Wendy's to burgers to burger joints is what like Popeyes was the chicken. Like it was the upscale elite mm. fucking establishment for fast food. <laughs> for real. When I worked at Burger King, I figured it out. If you could get you a Burger King burger in less than 30 seconds, it's the best shit you would have. But you got to eat that bitch straight off the grill, like. Anybody who ever worked there will tell you that. If you can, like, if the process from the kitchen to getting that bitch to you, that bitch it's lose about 30% of goodness. <laughs> you gotta literally eat them bitches in the kitchen for it to be hidden. <laughs> like, so you, you put it together. Up, tell them, can't nothing fuck with the burgers. Fresh off, if you ever if you got time to pull up and be like, run me a piece through that bitch. <laughs> <laughs> Them motherfuckers, I'm talking about you can't even stand to be back there, nigga, when you got 20 hamburgers. Like, nigga, it's, it's the grill on? <laughs> Tell me. Whatever. We just had this shit. <laughs> this nigga, he nigga. geeked up. No, I'm just saying. He ain't taking no shot? No. Okay, no. Come on, Carlos. You didn't even drink this shit. Bruh, I had a whole cup, bruh. Oh. You tripping, bruh. I'll just keep smoking this blunt. Oh, shit. I don't to fuck with this shit right there. Just liquor in general. Come on, so look, speaking of speaking of food and you know like restaurants and establishments and shit like that. When you're at home, what do you like to cook? Oh, see, ask me something else. <laughs> <laughs> no, that shit is a bad question, right there. <laughs> <laughs> That's sad. You ain't got nothing. Else. <laughs> what if God reached out and was like, Stab, I got this bitch. What is wrong? <laughs> oh my God. It ain't good, Cray. Uh, <clears throat> Cray, we don't never record at night. Why not? I don't know, we need to start. The vibe different. The vibe is totally different. Yeah, you get drunk. Kick. You get drunk and high at night. We call it in the daytime early. For real? Yeah. That's a different type of grind right there. You don't want corporate. Yeah. Scream. Right. <laughs> That's why most of them niggas be late. And them niggas be sound asleep. <laughs> yeah. Man, ain't been in this shit all day. I think we did stun shit late at night. Yeah, nighttime. we did. You gotta be out outside at night a little bit. That's when the free. My bad. Out. Yeah, at night. <laughs> well, I know this y'all first time in the trap, man. What y'all think? Fuck with it. Well, this place where I'm studio. Yeah. I'm a I'm man. Fucking with the trap. We've been off in here while we were off in here. I'm fucking with the trap. Yeah, man. Look at this shit, we got all kind of Niggas got their shoes off in the trap, man. I'm over there to sew my shoes off in the trap, man. Look at you talking about. I'm comfortable, man. Shout out to DC, his movie just yeah. let's go. Yeah. Nah, for sure. So he out there on the promo run, man, doing that for his movie. Where's the name of the movie? Nah, the one with uh, Cat Williams in there. Oh, hey, okay. What's the name of the cat? It ain't for the love of money, is it? Something like that. Is it is it Googleable? He can, he gonna pull it up. Yeah, it ain't man. no low budget shit. It's a lot of people in there, man. Hold on, Cat. Oh yeah, I seen that shit. I seen what you talking about. Don't do it like that. They had a for, that's no, the thing. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, I seen that. It. It. Yeah, it's like who in there, Cat? Lisa Ray. Yeah. Sweat. <laughs> yeah, he in there. Who? Bro, Tim. Oh, yeah. Jason Mitchell. Yeah. Yeah. Cat he was a super fly with you, right? Who? Jason Mitchell. See, bank a movie star and all that shit. Dude. <coughs> oh, shit no. Street legend. <coughs> Snow yeah. Patrol. He was, uh, what's his name's best friend? He was Pree's best friend. The little short nigga. Oh, that's the nigga who got them, you locked up with some shit too, right? Yeah, that shit going on, yeah. Okay. Now, you want to talk about a nigga who did a lot of shit. You ever seen his throwback pictures? His throwback pictures? Yeah, yeah. The ones he be posting? Man, that nigga had money since 1981. I just making it look good. 
<laughs> nigga had money. Nigga ate it. He had a box shed on some 11 inch dates. Nigga, <laughs> <laughs> <Yeah>, crazy. <laughs> <laughs> oh yeah, we kicking shit, man, for a long time, bro. Man. Yeah. No cap. And that was a low down, dirty days. Yeah, man. I'm different nigga low now. Low down, dirty black. That was his first name. Mm-hmm. Low down, dirty black. Yeah, Big Bang didn't come until probably like 2008. So you had to do a bunch of low down, dirty shit to get Big Bang. Mm -hmm. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Nah, I ain't really did no lowdown shit. No, hell no. I was just a black, ugly ass nigga, so you know. All the niggas black as hell, man, you look, you just look like you on some bullshit, bro. I just been profiled all my life. Shit get missing, <laughs> and everybody looking at the black ass. <laughs> Damn, man, it's hard like that. Yes, yes man. He you did. did it. You look guilty, man. Never did that. Like, bro, a nigga look He's guilty, brown, bro. You look like, like this, you look guilty. I be catching the same shit. For everybody. Huh? You say it to everybody. everybody. You guilty, yeah. man. Black is black. It don't matter what. Yeah. You know, no, but, but, but the blacker you are, the worse it gets. Yeah. Mm. Like when they show when they show some bullshit going on in the neighborhood, like they trying to show some grimy shit, what you see? Some black ass niggas out there. <laughs> they show no light skinned player looking nigga. They show a no black ass nigga. Like, it's dangerous over here. They show me. <laughs> over against the car. <laughs> over against the car, yeah. The hell going on here? You, they trying to profile you to all the bullshit. They done profile all of us. It's this color. All the black ass niggas. That shit fucked up. I ain't no been time me and Dave be places. And I be like, bro, you go in, them folks gonna be looking at me crazy. Answer. Like, bro, you gonna have to go in now. Them folks gonna be looking at me crazy. I the dealership got to take my car to the dealer. I don't even wanna pull up this black. You <laughs> Damn man. <laughs> hey, man. Hey, do me a favor. What's up, man? Let's make a hoodie that say that. What? I don't wanna pull up this black. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. You wanna pull up this black, man. God damn. Oh, man. Pull up. Oh, Be black as you I fucking need, are, hey, bro. Pull. I oh need, no, I'm not like kicking shit though. Yeah. I'm gonna talk the bottom of that. Fuck that, but I'm yeah. Like, yeah. yeah. I don't even yeah. want to pull up this black <laughs> on the edge. Yeah, that's all yeah, right. Yeah, we had it hard, man. Shit changing over a little bit now. Like, nah, man, we, oh, we had it hard. We can't even go in that bitch right now. I'm too black. <laughs> too black to be in there. Yeah, <laughs> bro. Well, you black as hell right now. I ain't fucking with you. <laughs> Damn, that's racist as fuck. Well. <laughs> Damn. No, we gonna, that's, that's the shit. That's what we're going to replace the word nigga with, just black. How you going to use it? You up to something. Yeah, because they gave us brownies to break. You up to something. This nigga that up to something. Yeah, man. You walk in the store, but they watching the hell out of you. They ain't even watching him, man. Me and him walking. He, I walk in the store, he already in there. Stealing like a motherfucker. <laughs> I steal every time I go to the store. You know what I'm saying? But they watching me. Hey, no, nah, I'm bullshitting. I don't never steal. I be stealing like a Unless I get caught. No, I, I act like I, I accidentally left it. Why? Can you go fuck yourself up? Why? They pay it like that. I ain't gonna be, I don't be stuck. Like, it's a, they got them, what's your name by the spot? That CVS? Oh, they probably got me. Uh, <laughs> on the video, oh, 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 with the picture. He one of them niggas, he's like a, he's like a clef though. Like, oh, oh, like, don't, don't say that, bro. Now they gonna be, no, don't say that, man. Welcome back to the new class, No, what would our ancestors say? We don't admit to a goddamn thing, man. You right about that? We don't admit to nothing. <laughs> Keep it black. <laughs> Nigga pocket loaded. Oh. Oh, God. Chapstick. Mm. <laughs> <laughs> Gotta have it. <laughs> no, no man, I just started putting it on. Damn. <laughs> Put a hat on or something, just walk around and stuff. <laughs> Oh, I forgot. Pull out a guy, them 10,000. See? And that's why, and that's why people need No damn one like stealing. I get it. <laughs> this nigga that used all the products, ate all the shit in there. <laughs> Just to pull no out the bag roll. No damn one like stealing. <laughs> pull out the bag roll. <laughs> pull out a 40 bottle. <laughs> Yeah, how much is this? <laughs> Already oh, oh, shit. Already <laughs> <laughs> <laughs>
I'm wearing it. I'm wearing it. I'm wearing it. Shoot to ring it up. I went back there and got it. Crazy. Oh, you went in the back. I got money. I got money. <laughs> you want some from the food? Got that ass too. I'm going to get you something. <laughs> yeah, got that ass too. What you say? Welcome to 885. Welcome back to 885. Oh, man. Your grandma's favorite podcast to watch while she making greens. Did you know that? This is the number one black TV show that's not on TV. It's on the TV, though. Yeah. It go further than the TV. Yeah, but if you watch it on the TV, it's a TV Ooh, show. But you can watch it on anything. Yeah, but if you choose to put it on your TV, it's a TV show. Thanks. But if you watch it on your phone, it's a phone show. That's on TV also. Yeah, but you got to put it on your TV. Easy. Because, I, I mean, I made it available for your phone and your TV. That was one of the requirements. Right. It's a station. You got your station there, right? Exactly. Come it's on. App. Satellite. It's a stream. We got all kinds of shit on there. Channel 85. <laughs> oh, oh, Lord. It, it, oh, Lord. <laughs> it's not like Birdman. We just hit that up. Listen, man, we just hit that mic, man. <laughs> <laughs> we already up to 5,000. You hear me? Trying to get it up to 8,500. <laughs> First 8,500, get to see something that you ain't never seen before. Ooh. <laughs> we out here with it. We keeping it for the streets. And, you know, we keeping it available all across the world, too, man. Shout out to South Africa. You fucking with it. All the other nations. All the country, man. We hitting all over the world. They fuck with it. I'm telling you. All the places, bro. You know the list is long. Man, I got some Chilean homeboys who can't wait for this shit to come out. Come on, man. I'm pulling up. Malaysia. Malaysia? Mm-hmm. Yucatan Peninsula? New Zealand. That's a boy. What about them bitches from Carousel? What about all my people over there? in Germany, Gluckenstein and shit like that. That's back off in the valley. Okay. It's mm-hmm. hills, it's a lot of hills. I mean, we gotta go to the goddamn, you know, they fuck with us in the UK. My niggas in Belgium who wear them, them funny looking boots. <laughs> <laughs> Lemon pepper steppers. Yeah, them Cambodians rock with them. You remember the Berlin Wall? The niggas that stayed on this side? Who was that turkey? Fucks with this shit heavy. They fuck with it. That's Prussia. Yeah. East Africa. Y'all look so lost. Then West Africa too. <laughs> Eritrea. I'm just letting y'all know all the places that they fuck with this shit. 85 Global. Yeah, yeah. Deep down in Moscow. Tanzania. Tanzania. Yeah. Zimbabwe right with it. Yeah. The Cameroon. Speaking countries right outside of Haiti. Can't get enough of it. Dominican Republic? Almost. It's close to it. It's just right in the middle. They could go either way. Found out about a new place, man. People who live in the flat land. You know them countries where everybody ride bikes? Dini got the perfect high music too. Turn it up a little bit. What you think? <laughs> that shit gets you higher. Yeah, that shit get me high. Turn this up a little bit, bro. Okay, you know yeah, let's go ahead. Let's keep kicking it. Where we at? Where we at? Right now? Go ahead. I got to say good morning to everybody who watched this shit in Paris, France. Because I know they get down with it. Lithuania. Ooh. All up and through the Swiss Alps. Come on. Greenland. Finland. Fucking right, because I was about to say that. Newfoundland. Oh, hell yeah. Deep down in the heart of Australia, where the Aborigines live. Nope. <laughs> 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 
Yeah, yeah. <laughs> 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 yeah. They ain't too good. They ain't too cold to really just fuck around. Like. <laughs> Everybody out there on the series too. Yeah, it's like this. It ain't a lot of leisure in Antarctica. Mm. You know, it's dark six months out of the year out there, so. It's dark six months out of the year. Mm. What you mean? No sun. It's like nighttime. The whole months. yeah. Man, I ain't never know. I don't know a lot about geography and all that shit. Like a lot of those places y'all just name, I never heard of. All my people over there in Oman, they love this shit. Bangladesh, Dubai, and Abu Dhabi, Fiji. Yeah, that's Madagascar area. Most of the people in the Mediterranean. <laughs> Turkey. Yeah. Got gotcha. You gotta mention Greece if you're gonna bring up Turkey. Right. Yeah. You got a lot of niggas deep down in Rome and shit. What about Laos? Yeah. Laos. Laos and Sri Lanka. Lagos. Laos and Lagos. We all up been through Nigeria. That's big. Because <coughs> that's like, that's one of the most urban areas over here in that continent. Yeah, I've been to Lagos before. Yeah, Senegal. You already know. We I want to go, man. Africa, y'all fuck with us, man. <clears throat> nah, they let go. 85 turn. South Africa. That's what we got. The light of the hood. We're going to find out whatever, you know what I'm saying? We, we might have to change it. It might have to be like 16688 West. Whatever they wrote in. Whatever they wrote in. <clears throat> Where's the veto from? Nigeria. The nigga from Africa. Nigeria. Wherever he's from, they got like these big ass, like cheetah looking lion things that they have on like a, a fucking, like a chain, but they're like pets. Okay. Like hyenas? They got hyenas? They might be, but they big as fuck. <clears throat> I don't know. They're huge. But like, they got some, they got some crazy shit on here. Like, this <clears throat> and this. We I'm got some gonna, crazy gonna... shit over here too. They need to know about the crazy shit we got. Right. Hell yeah. We got dogs over here that live in the house with humans that understand black people English. Did you know if you're a black person with a dog, that your dog understands that y'all are black? What's your name? <laughs> you ever had a dog? You ever had a dog that was like a black dog? And then some white people came around and your dog ran up to him and was like, take me with you. I don't want to live with you. <laughs> Take me with you, man. You ain't never seen your dog ain't never showed out on your white folk. Your dog won't come back. Get your ass over here. I'm sorry, man. Hey, no, he's good. Let me, let me, let me, let me pet him. Is everything okay, buddy? <laughs> That's fucked up. What are you trying to say? That's fucked up. You know what? I'm gonna take this dog with me. I don't think the dog's sick. And your dog will be looking back like bitch. <laughs> if you don't believe me, man, as a black person, watch how your dog act around white people. Mm. It's either they either gonna do that or they gonna look and be like. Dogs know. Yeah. But they know. Because ever since I brought up how white people dogs act, everybody been seeing them clips of what them white people dogs is up to. Bro. What you mean? Nigga, it's this video of this dog. This man was on the roof, man. The dog went up there and checked on him, climbed the ladder and everything. There was another video. The lady walked in on her dog. He was fucking washing dishes. Yeah. Oh, I saw that shit. I saw that. What? That's crazy. This type of shit white people dog do. You ain't never seen no black dog do nothing amazing. He was washing dishes. Exactly. And then they got this other one. They didn't got this little shit where the dog can push the button and tell them what the fuck they want, bro. Straight talking. Man, fuck that. Did y'all see the video of the nigga in Florida that trapped the alligator in the Herbie Kirby? And a, what? What? Is, what's the oh, in the tra yeah, the little trash cans, right? The little, right, little, the little trash oh, recycling shit. shit. Yeah. Chasing the fucking alligator around I seen that. the driveway and caught it in the fucking Herbie Kirby. They did that shit in flip flops. Yeah. A lot of people don't know how brave you got to be to live in Florida. <laughs> Florida, come on, man. Florida got all kinds of shit, man. That shit really like Jurassic Park, man. 
Florida got these big ass lizards that just come out of nowhere. Yeah, out of nowhere, bro. Big as fuck. I'm talking about them bitches you see at the zoo. Them big ass lizards. You might just be chilling, and next thing you know, you look up, it's a fucking big ass lizard right there. That shit happened to me at the hotel. That nigga looked at me like, nigga, ain't nobody gonna fuck with you. <laughs> the lizard? Big ass, I'm talking about a dog sized lizard. Yeah. This nigga just like walked up and looked and just kept on walking like he was going some fucking way. Yeah. Scared the yeah. shit out of me. You can just park the car and just watch how the fucking grass be moving. It be some big ass shit out there. Some of them shit be lizards, some of that shit, you don't know what the fuck it is. Some of that shit be, you know, alligator. Oh, out there, motherfucker. This is shit. I can only imagine. Lizards, big ass pythons and anacondas crawling all around that motherfucker. There's all kind of shit in that, in that swamp. Man, all around that motherfucker. You might just look off on the side of the road, see some shit you ain't never seen before, man. Every crazy story I hear about Florida, I believe that shit. I done seen too much shit down there. The nigga, I, last time I was in Florida, I went to the CBS. The nigga was standing there bleeding, man. Him and his girl had gotten into it. She stabbed his ass. He in there trying to buy some band-aids for the shit. <laughs> for a stab? Yes. <laughs> I can't say stand, but she cut the shit out of him. But he was actively, actively bleeding, trying to buy some band-aids. I'm like, this is the craziest shit I ever saw. <laughs> <laughs> you get retarded, man. What, man? Fuck that. I'm through talking, but What the hell you talking about? This some shit I seen in Florida. <laughs> you say you through talking? You high. Because <laughs> I know I'm high. Mm. And you was like, what? Huh? I'm all right, and I hadn't even smoked, so I know y'all gotta be through the moon. No, I'm just right there on the doorstep. Shit vibed out, though. Say what? The shit vibed out. That's what it's all about, man. I wanted y'all to come down here and experience this vibe and just let you know that we fuck with y'all in a real way, man. Vice versa. Yeah, yeah. 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 <laughs> what we doing, Scream? Clayton, what you got coming up, man? You got something about the release? <laughs> Man, same old thing, man. You know what it is, November 24th, Disney Plus. Yeah. What it is? Uh, Hawkeye on Disney Plus. So, yeah. What is it? Yeah, like it's a TV show. show. TV show? Yeah. You You're acting in a TV show on Disney? Yeah. What you doing? What you doing? Uh, playing uh, something I can't talk about, but. <laughs> it's just in the show we can't say shows. what we're doing. Yeah. It's one of the Marvel shows, so if I say something. Yeah, it we might be a nigga out there sitting on my car. We just gonna play it back. Yeah, wait till it comes. But they're not gonna—they're not gonna get mad at you about yeah, like will. some. Yeah, that's yeah, what I'm will. saying. If I say something about. No, I'm it, talking it about like, like about the thing. Huh? They knew I was me before I was me. Oh, okay. okay. No, this I've been me okay. when I was okay. me. Right so you know, and we in California, we in Amsterdam when we shoot a lot of these right. episodes. Yeah, Plus, yeah, when yeah, we put his name up there, we from a lot of these. Just put Sabado Domingo in it. Who? Cut this part out, Joseph. <laughs> Joseph, just go. Joseph, Bro. cut all this out. No, Stop seriously. Yeah. Right. Yeah, two separate entities. Wow. Right. Give me a, a, a what you call it? Smart. A whole nother LLC. What that mean? That means that we can, we're not, have, we're not liable to one thing. Mm-hmm. He didn't do that as himself. Oh, no. He did it as an entirely different entity. Yeah, under his company. Oh. Yeah. Shock G Humpty Hump. Yeah, just to protect all his interests. Mm. <laughs> Rest in peace. Yeah. You already down. You put us down. You showed us how to do this independent shit and keep the grand going. Little do you know, you know what I'm saying? Whatever, you ain't gonna talk about it. I do shit you do. <laughs> <laughs> the nigga gonna act like he ain't do shit. He ain't put on for a minute, man. I heard this nigga drop one song, and like, you know, these niggas don't need nothing. <laughs> 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 Did the fuck out of that. I might just take that route, man. Nah, don't go that route, bro. I did that Gemini shit, bro. I got there and wake up one day and hold another nigga. For real. Oh, God. Okay. Well, I'm Four working. o'clock, I'm back myself. I'm working on a blues album right now. <laughs> For real? Called Fry My Wings Hard. Huh? Fry His Wings Hard. 
I'm not winning hard. Chicken spot. That's the first single. That's Yo, trying to chicken shit. Like. <laughs> no, that's the name of the whole project. Fry my wings hard. What's the first single? We ain't picked one yet. Still working on it. Okay. Oh, God. Yeah, we about to take over the streets in every way, man. Everything got to. we got. Ain't gonna be, ain't gonna be no way around Atlanta for real. No. Chicken yeah. wing spot, burger spot. Might open up a spaghetti house or something. A house of spaghetti. They said that shit Eminem got up there doing them noodles is booming. I bet it's Eminem though. You know, he's he's good. <laughs> you know, he said he do the shit up though. Do a vomit mom spaghetti. Right. Now you selling spaghetti? <laughs> And you know, yeah, I don't, yeah. don't want no white people's spaghetti. I like black people's if you spaghetti. You grow up in the restaurant, you get free spaghetti to take home or some shit. It's probably fucking. What? <laughs> you got us just out here trying host to host to host here, man. I know you see us struggling. Who? Who? Who hell? Who struggling? This shit show, bro. I know you see us struggling for it to host. We yeah, load it every Wednesday. Oh, this shit show go crazy. Yo, yo, we load it. We ain't even talking about it. Yeah. We need Carlos Miller to step. In the building. Here you go. You ain't it called me yet. Went, bro. I ain't called you. Nigga, I've been begging you. you. you nigga, I DM this nigga, text this nigga. We need me. you. <laughs> what y'all been Nah, doing? we gotta do some hard shit, huh? What y'all been doing over there? Going crazy. Missing you. Been going crazy with them folk out there. <laughs> you just were doing some different shit, bro. I ain't gonna cap. <laughs> Cause you had me rolling the whole nice. show night. I know how y'all niggas doing that 15,000 people venues and shit. You, you got me in this motherfucker. You know how to handle the crowd, my brother. Shit. You got the crowds fucked up. I've never <laughs> seen it, man. It's a, it's a lot going on. Shout out to the whole shit show. Everybody. <laughs> You gotta tell the Definitely people. Definitely a great experience. You gotta nah, tell the people what it is. It's he popped it out. Well that don't Bro know. popped it out yeah. with us on some real shit. Yeah. And, yeah. and he was letting us know every show. I'm, I'm just doing it. some shit for the streets, bro. I don't need this little shit y'all trying to do. <laughs> he was letting us know that every show. Look here, man. What are you talking about about this shit, bro? I'm really just helping you, my nigga, cause I, I got my shit. We going crazy. No, I appreciate it, though, bro. You helped pop that shit off, my bro. Yeah. In there, man. We had you on the fly here. We hosted yeah. by Carlos Miller. <laughs> I, just, I always like to do shit like that to stay, like, you know, comedically stay in shape. Just yeah. go into a gauntlet and see what happens. Nah, that should be epic, though, from the shit I've been seeing. Nah, we're going to do one, one big show. We're going to bring you the host, get somebody like Mary J. Blige to got I'm putting a motherfucking suit on. We're going to do one big one. You had Monica in there, right? Mm -hmm. Yeah. Shout out to Monica. Everybody be people. coming through there, yeah. We made all them thug niggas in there crap, man. Yeah, nah, we turned yeah. up. She walked up on stage. She already had her own microphone, and then she did kind of like wave, and then you looked up, and then there was just a microphone in her hand. <laughs> Some of that shit got went to the... Niggas was like, man, that shit was beautiful. <laughs> <laughs> and she had kids. And you know how she came a little late. Niggas had been smoking and shit. I promise you, it was about 20 niggas in there crying. For real. Gangsters. No not, not no, no wimps. Cap. These Gangsters. niggas was. And singing. The whole crowd. Just. It like a gospel experience. Yeah. Ghetto gospel. What's the best city you think you went in? Like, the best response in which city? Every city, any city that I say, the next one I go to, they gonna try to outdo them. Yeah. Any yeah. city that you can go to that you're not from and you can sell anything, that's that's a blessing. That's right power. There. Hell yeah. For real. Because there's somebody who lived there. Yeah. That's having a show for free. And they chose to see a nigga like me. And they're paying the fee. Yeah, so. But that's that was your jingle? Yeah, yeah one of them. <laughs> He's making carols, man. Fuck the jingle. Yeah. Making carols, man. Fuck a jingle. It's to give them some shit that they can't get nowhere else. Man. In Atlanta. The next Fox Theater. Sub show. Yeah. Yeah. What y'all doing for the holidays? I want to get some tickets to the 85 front row. Me I'm too. saying y'all doing like some giveaways and shit like that. Y'all want trying to get you to give away some. For, for the community. I'm trying to get you to give away some tickets. Oh, <laughs> that's. 
Yeah. How you got it? How, how yeah. y'all got it? Fox. Fox still got them little booths. I don't know. Oh yeah. We'll see. I'm gonna call you. I'm coming. Yeah, yeah. I'll fuck with that. Yeah, come through, man. Give away what? I'm right. saying like what we doing for Christmas and like shit like that. The holidays coming up. We Let's some, do something. Let's put it together. Feed the streets or something. We get some uh, twelve thousand turkey sandwiches or something. Turkey went up. What about chicken? Yes, yeah, so we, we doing the chicken. Like we ain't established nothing yet. Turkey. Turkey's expensive. Turkey as fuck. going up, bro. We need to go and get them now. Freeze. Get some Cornish hens. <laughs> <laughs> That's why I said we'll do turkey sandwiches this year. Hey, turkey's going hey, up. Hey, hey. <laughs> Hey. Oh, got him in the little cell back, yeah. zip lock back. Everybody get two. It's rough out here. It's rough out here. Make sure you get two. Make sure you get two. Like you down to free time. It's a juice. Two little mustard packs. Yeah. We got a cool one with some juice in it. Get some juice too. We do something, man. And a cookie that fucked up. Nah, what what you trying to do? Something. We gotta do something. Man, let's man. put that shit together, man. It's right around the corner. We gotta get we on gotta that now. We gotta do something, man. We gotta send the niggas in jail a bunch of t shirts or something, man. For sure, I'm with it. What else? Say, them niggas in jail don't need nothing. Some of them. <laughs> they gonna get two sandwiches. Oh. <laughs> Nigga can use the extra two t-shirts. Those motherfuckers, where they at in jail? <laughs> two t-shirts. Nigga get the extra, hey, get on, line up. We got the t-shirts. Oh, this been a pretty decent little Christmas, right? <laughs> 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 okay. Two shirts. <laughs> I got six now. <laughs> I'm just going to say that to visitation. Oh, man, stupid. I'm going to lay on that. I'm going to wait till I'm going to that off. Mm. But that's what we're doing for. Keep it, keeping the vibe going. Make sure you go and listen to a classic DJ Scream mixtape. Yeah. Hell yeah. Listen to a lot of that shit. Scream did our first shit too. Word. The Alley Boy. Yeah, Alley Boy shit. Alley Boy. The Dine. Uh, that shit was hard. Mm-hmm. Plies. I got on plies on your shit, too. Supposed to do one with Bang. Huh? I was supposed to do one with Bang. Yeah, you know how that shit goes. <laughs> I ain't do no mid-take, did I? I did one mid-take. You did the one with Bigger? Yeah, with Bigger Ranks. See? Then he quit. <laughs> <laughs> really quit before I even started call up being real. <laughs> <laughs> shit like this. Shit, bro. I already let you. <laughs> <laughs> I'm doing me a nigga say fuck it. I just don't like them shows. Why not? I don't know. Dealing with them promoters and shit. Yeah, like not even just going to them, t just, I don't like that shit. Like none of that shit cool. I don't like grabbing the mic and just, I'm a rapper, I'm a rapper. I don't like that. I got, I like Big Fat Line, you know what I'm saying? Talking about shit, I'm chilling, I'm being me. Yeah. Like I'm, I'm out there doing, try not, try, that ain't what I was trying to do. Cause they started booking us with goddamn Travis Porter and shit. Yeah, yeah. Not, no, it's not, no. not that there's nothing wrong with that, but they started booking me with the, like yeah. I'm like I'm goddamn finna do some other shit. No, like this, a dancey kind of thing. It's pimping I'm doing. Right. Y'all ain't catching the memo. I get. I know it's on a Zay beat hopping, but they ain't y'all trying to put me on something else. Like I would have brought me four aunties at that bitch and sung that song to them four times. And I'm like y'all have a good night. <laughs> Like, they were coming some money though. I know, you should have got with me. That shit just wasn't me. I mean, we would have had that motherfucker lit. That shit just wasn't me, bro. <laughs> they wasn't gonna drive to the show. Yeah. Mm -hmm. I like this shit though. Cause this nigga really just chilling. I fuck with this. We just high. We can get that information out. Yeah, we just high, man. Like, this it. What else? What more could you ask for? Niggas are stupid. Mm. My grandma used to tell me when I was young, I talked too much, so I stopped talking. I know she like, didn't even start getting money off talking now. Mm -hmm. That little shit heavy, like, oh, this motherfucker smart. Nah, we just talking shit. Yeah. Yeah. All that shit you would get in trouble for, the shit I get paid for now. <laughs> talking shit. Cussing, goddamn. Being loud, goddamn. You know what I'm saying? All that shit. shit. Mm -hmm. Not sitting still, yeah. That's all the shit I make money off of. Hey. That shit come back around. Smoking weed. They get in trouble for smoking weed. No, but people need this shit. 
They need this. Oh, man. The people who watch this shit, they need this. They need this as much as we need to do this. Yeah, I need this shit. This shit therapy for me, because I get to just talk, because I don't be talking about shit. I, just I told you to open up and talk about that shit, but you was like, nope. Just got to let it go. That's why I just be so peaceful at this point. I done said this shit already. I'll just be scrolling Instagram, looking at these memes, and be like, oh, it's cute. I remember when I said it. You know, so they deserve a like. I like that. Oh, man. Just dropping platinum jokes out here, man. Thanks. And niggas still can't say saucy biscuit. <laughs> <laughs> What you, what you think about uh, Dave Chappelle? I think Dave Chappelle just, he just, Dave Chappelle, man. Like one for one. When you done made it that far in that shit, you just, yeah. what can you say? You can't lose. Shit, I hope he do some more shit. He gonna do some more shit. I mean, I hope he do some, some more groundbreaking shit. And this is only the beginning. You got a documentary. Oh, yeah. Some more shit going on. Hey, you better make them folks respect that shit. Council what? I do this shit out my backyard. Hey, man, if you good at business, you, <laughs> Council, you know, anybody who do business will tell you, man, some good press or some bad press is still. Good press. Right. Come on. As long as they talking about you, if you good at business, you're you relevant. Know how to capitalize off this shit. Mm. You might double it up, cause motherfuckers that hate this shit gotta see what you're talking about, so they know the what they the mad part about. about life. <laughs> it's like got... you already just said. Huh? <laughs> Say that again. Nah, them niggas that hate on your shit gotta watch the shit, so they know what they mad about. So you actually <laughs> double up on <laughs> how many people see first your one. shit. And then you gotta keep in mind, it's more motherfuckers who on the dirty than us on the good. So yeah. Once that, once you get cast out. Now you can go into the whole underworld, which is far more lucrative than these people who canceling you. Facts. Yeah. Do you, it's like, just like they got some people who cancel motherfuckers, they got a whole nother side of people who that's all they want. Mm -hmm. It's the folks who don't nobody fuck with. Mm -hmm. them. That's gonna be the reason that they push you to an even bigger market. Bring your ass over here with us. We all been canceled too. What are you drinking? Right. right. <laughs> Yeah, now you finna get all them. What'd you do? Well, I was grabbing titties. <laughs> <laughs> what'd you think about... Trump ran wrong. Push. Exactly. What'd you think about the community trying to re-accept the baby and uh -uh. super... We're, we're not even engaging those people's affairs. I don't think anything. The community. You don't, don't want a letter from the community. Uh, you don't want the community letter. But I mean, how long? Where they send you? How long can they stay mad at somebody? I don't know. They, I don't know. I guess these are problems that'll work themselves out. Mm. I don't have a dog in that fight. <laughs> <laughs> what are you trying to eat? <laughs> a lot of slippery slopes out here. You gotta avoid them. Yeah, you right. Well, I mean. They were pretty upset at him. But then they found somebody they were more upset about, so. Can't it's a matter focus. of time. Like, I guess yeah, you just gotta so let somebody else. The other shit that happened, they was like, we need all hands on deck. <laughs> somebody else gotta fuck up. Hey. So yeah. it, was some, it was some of that nature. Mm -hmm. Well, I guess we gotta wrap this shit up. Nah, hell nah, we chillin', man. For real? Oh, you got somebody out there? Hell no. Nah. I need putting niggas out? Nah, we, we don't <laughs> never put nobody out the trap. Yeah, we chillin', man. I'm sure. We got this nice little jingle playing. We were trying to figure out a way to turn that bitch into a carol. <laughs> mm. Trying to figure out who I'm gonna get on that bitch. Probably put Marvin Gaye's grandson on there or something. What's his name? What'd he do, sing or rap? I don't know. I just know he know how to fuck with some music in some form or fashion. I don't even know if Marvin Gaye got a grandson, but whatever. <laughs> he probably will. Him and Gerald Levert's nephew. Now, Gerald Levert was a talented motherfucker. 
Us next, we gotta be able to do something. <laughs> oh, this is what I was gonna ask y'all. What historical black person should have had a mixtape? What you mean? Frederick Douglass. Any black person in history. That nigga Frederick Douglass go hard, his tape would go crazy. Frederick Douglass? Yeah, he whooped the slave, he whooped the nigga trying to whoop him one time. How you gonna have a mix? I don't know. How you gonna have a mix? Nah, they saying, he saying like. Nat. 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 Nat Turner mix say you would get home. Yeah, Nat Turner mix say you would get home. Nat Turner mix. Nat Turner mix say you would get home. Yeah. That shit. <laughs> that shit tell you what you're supposed to do. He got Killer Cracker. There's a bunch of songs on there. Who? But it's a lot of niggas. It's a lot of niggas who died yeah. fuck with that shit who were hard though. See, we gotta think. See, they just showing up the niggas who went out, like, got their feet cut out, coons can't take, whatever. What about them niggas who got there? Some of them niggas doing some shit. Had some to be. Niggas said hell no. Nah. It's gotta be. Man. I ain't I'm going for that, bro. Nigga they just probably dead, man, huh? So bad he had to go get the clan to help. Yes. He dogged the white man ass out in front of the whole fucking city. That's Frederick Douglass. Frederick Douglass whooped the nigga ass that was supposed to be whooping him. They went around the house. Wasn't nobody there to get to him. And he pieced his ass up. <laughs> and he said that motherfucker avoided him the rest of the goddamn time. He was working on that bitch. He was like one of the little overseers or some shit. Yeah. Cat said he didn't want to hear that, that uh, Muhammad Ali mixtape. Oh, man. Oh, straight rhyming. Man, you know what I want to hear? I want to hear some Michael Jackson songs with some trap beats behind it. You already kind of got it. No, it need to be a mixtape of just Michael Jackson with some trap beats. Who y'all think could have battled Michael Jackson on the verses? Michael Jackson Shit, nobody. himself three different times. Yeah, each shade. He, I would like to see. I want to see a, uh, like, the last little bit of dark skin Mike versus Puerto Rican Mike versus light skin Mike. When he Puerto Rican? You Puerto don't remember when Mike was Puerto Rican a little bit? <laughs> you that was right like before the Keep it in the closet first, and shit. The first, the first, the first time he tried to. The way you make me feel, that was Puerto Rican Mike. When he was wearing the shit around his waist. Mike. With the little, with the little flap. <laughs> you don't remember when Mike was Puerto Rican a little bit? Uh uh, we had shit. We Man, yeah, Mike was Puerto Rican for about a good four or five years. Man. But he was light, but brown skin. Nah, man, he had a little ponytail and everything with the, when he first started wearing the ponytail with the swoop. <laughs> Fuck out of here, man. Watch the Keep It In The Closet video. That's Puerto Rican Mike. <laughs> <laughs> I'm telling you, man, you don't, you don't pay attention to the trends, man. Oh, so what he was, Lil Black Michael. That was like off the wall, PYT. That's the last little bit of dark skin, Mike. I wanna love you. Yeah. PYT. Yeah. You said that's the last. That's the last little bit of dark skin, Mike. Cause then when Mike came back, bad was the was kind of the beginning of Puerto Rican Mike. Cause remember, that's the first time he really came back and like niggas was listening to him. You mm. feel me? He was hitting him with Shamon. We're like, where the fuck Shamon come from? Yeah. Yeah, like, that's kind of. What the fuck like, is that? Yeah. When he started doing all when he started doing the ad living <laughs> shit for real, nigga was like, what is this? That's cause he was Puerto Rican. And he was two of them trying to come out when he was sick. Puerto Rican Mike was doing the ad libs. <laughs> but you know, Puerto Rican Mike disappeared. You know why? Cause he sound too much like Janet. Uh, that's a fool. Cause he just kind of stopped and he was like, I'm gonna let my little sister have that. Then he went to like, that light skin shit. So you don't think nobody in the world, he couldn't battle elders? I mean, versus elders. See, now you're gonna make the racist people show up in the comments. What? Can't even bring up elders. You <laughs> don't mention the king of rock and roll. <laughs> what about, what about John Lennon or Paul McCartney? Uh, they can't fuck with Michael gotta Jackson. Be, yeah, it gotta be Michael Jackson and Prince, bro. Man, you that's two different genres of music. No. Nah, I mean, yeah, that's different. It, yeah, that's different. Two man. different genres. Cause that's then why it's like what you gonna base that off of. Cause Prince gonna argue you down that he played 50 instruments on these songs that you just played. Mm -hmm. Michael, you're like, that's too bad. You should focus more on singing. <laughs> <laughs> Mm 
that nigga get, fucked up, bro. You get to heaven and they got a concert together. But it's your first date and you don't know if you're gonna make it. Mm. <laughs> I ain't settled in yet, I gotta unpack. <laughs> <laughs> Time to start. Uh, Whenever you get there, man, this is heaven. Alright, whatever. <laughs> Whenever you get there, this is heaven. Just throw it away. I don't think nobody could have battled Mike though. It was just, he too good. It's too much, like. Michael Jackson was Jesus. Who gonna battle Jesus? Nazareth? <laughs> you thought that was a person? It's you thought it was Jesus and Nazareth. Yeah, that's, that means, it was that's me, like Jesus, you. and Nazareth, Shadrach, Meshach, you thought that and a little while person. ago. <laughs> no, that's where he from. That's how they ripped their hood back in the day. Oh, man. Is Drake the Michael Jackson? Like, no. I'm just saying Drake what he the first be the only one. one. I'm I'm just just saying, saying a lot of Michael Jackson references in the shit. He said he could dance like Michael Jackson. To him. <laughs> everybody in this room then tried to, everybody in this room got their version of them dancing like Michael Jackson. Is he this day, day is, he, said, is, he, is he this day? The present day. Is he the equivalent of the biggest shit? No, nobody, do they faint like that? No. He broke, he broke a lot of their records. They ain't faint like that because you can see a nigga on Instagram. Oh, man. That's only why they faint because you couldn't see Mike till you see him. That's a good point. All right, right. That's right. a good point. If they weren't if they right. seeing Drake, they'll be faint. You had to get a magazine or see him on stage. That's it. You are on the Star power different these days, too. It is. It's, it's a whole different ball game out here. Back then, that shit was like, people crying when they see you. All right, right. think about this. Think about right. how many motherfuckers are that famous that we don't even know. Like who? Shit, we don't know. Yeah. It's motherfuckers on the other side of the internet that we ain't even heard of. Yet. People got all type of fans, yeah. yeah. Hundreds of millions of followers. We have no clue what they do. Everything they put up on YouTube get 330 million views a week. We don't know these people. Yeah. You're right about we don't that. know what the fuck they into. Mm -hmm. Yeah. You can get famous for some. You can get famous for eating with a microphone in your face right now, because people like the way that shit sound. Yo, ASMR. Yeah, people with have different whispering. fetishes about yeah. different things. That's how people like get paid off of like foot pictures and exactly. all that kind of old shit. Yeah. It's a it's a bartender that work at a club in Boston that got her titties done. That got four million followers and this bitch make four. You know what I'm saying? She, she going crazy on the internet. You don't know who that is, though. <laughs> What's an Instagram? I don't know. I'm just saying. <laughs> <laughs> they out here. Yeah. The way this shit is set up, man, is it's different. You never know. Nah, real shit. Yeah. That's why, so it's room for a nigga to get some money though, basically, man. Niggas playing, man. You could do anything and get paid. Mm-hmm. He's getting paid off nothing. We ain't doing nothing right here. To them, I'm working. <laughs> <laughs> you ain't working. I'm working, I'm working like a mother. <laughs> I am stabbed on hand right now. You know what I'm saying? No, I'm just, I, I know exactly what you're saying. We never would have thought that this would have been there. The way to build a fucking old empire. Mm -hmm. But all of this shit goes hand in hand. Without this, it ain't no, it ain't no 12, 13,000. You have to give them something to look forward to and build it up. Yeah. And sell them that shit before they even buy it. Like if y'all like that, wait till you see this. Mm -hmm. It's the variety. <laughs> How the live show experience been for y'all? Fuck with it. It's been great. It's dope, dope set. The energy is crazy. Just to interact with the people who watch that shit is the best shit. Mm-hmm. I'm really surprised who watched that shit. It's never who you think it is. Mm -mm. Right. Man, I fuck with that shit. I watch that shit every day. But you know, 
I definitely do. Because every time I'm on YouTube, shit come up on my little. Let me see who that is. What they talking about? Mm -hmm. Right verse. Oh, Ain't no other way. That's the new TV. Fuck TV, man. See, that's the thing about the internet, man. We ain't never had this kind of freedom to watch whatever we wanted to. Yeah, whatever facts. We wanted to. facts. That was yeah. a game changer. Whoever put all this content available at our disposal, at our disposal was. was this is these kids' TV. At a time in YouTube when it shit, you could run out of shit to watch on them. Now you would never be able to watch all that shit. I Anything remember when it was you, cable and it wasn't on on demand. I'm talking about some shit that you could pull up that you never thought you would see again. Commercials and shit like that that just take you back to a time when you first seen that shit. Mm -hmm. There's so much resources on that shit. You can really just go, like, if you, whatever you into, you can really sit there and just find as much of that shit as you could possibly watch. Mm-hmm. But yeah, man. 85 South Show. Big facts. Yeah. Big facts. Now let them know where they can find everything at. Big facts. www.bigfactspod.com. Salute. Social media. Big facts. Big facts pod. pod. Baby Jade. Oh, Big Facts Live, too. Yeah, Big, Big Facts Live. live. What's yeah. your shit, bro? Big Bang. What's your shit? Big oh, yeah, Big Bang DT. I got a bag of paid duct tape bank. Cause I know they trying to get me. Mm -hmm. I won't really be posting shit no more, man. I really be, I be saying some fun ass shit I be want to post, but that shit just too there borderline. Them folks done told me, next time, not know, you know, they use, they first they sent you on the verge to losing your pay. They sent me shit like, hey, look, <laughs> next time you post some more shit like that, bro, we taking it. Straight up point. <laughs> <laughs> like, there's no misunderstanding. This is not a warning. This is the real deal. <laughs> so I just fell back from that shit, man. Yeah. What you? What about you, Screen? DJ Screen. At DJ Screen. BigFactsPod.com. Triple W dot. BigFactsPod. Yeah, I forgot that part. My bad. Yeah. And Triple W. And my new address is uh, Channel85.com. Nah, for real. Go Straight fuck up. with that. Big fat. That's what I'm dropping over here, man. Don't just did an M, bro. Time. Today no, we just did an M, bro. Today. This trap. Walking in the trap, we just look screen to show we did an M with you, bro. We platinum in these streets. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. That's see, do you see that? You see how that shit lined up? It's crazy. Mm -hmm. How would it just be today? Today. Right. That's a fool. Man, we got what you say, Screen? Man, run that shit back, man. <laughs> <laughs> man, anytime. Yeah, man. Well look. Just give me a key to the trap. I'm pulling up, man. Man, you know where we yeah. at, man. But congratulations, man. We really Vice have versa King. Yeah. My boy Clay about to be on this Disney play. Hey man, look, man. Hey man. First of all, they got their money, man. We gotta get our money, man. We gotta celebrate black shows that goddamn, especially represent for the goddamn South, which is what these two shows are. We don't get a lot of Southern artists on shit to tell their stories, none of that shit. So, yeah, and that's what me and this nigga been talking about, and to see the shit and the way y'all put it with y'all mm -hmm. expertise in the goddamn field. Yeah. Super dope, man. So, Shout out yeah. to Big Homie Kodak, too. Yeah. Big Homie. Yeah, big homie. Nigga, that boy Yike in the bank. Shot Jones and Cashews. We got the crew, man. We, we be mobbing out. Bro. You see our whole game full up. We, we, hey, hey Yike, we be mobbing out. Our whole game pull up. Remember our same people that been from the beginning. Like, mm -hmm. we got our whole game. That's how I direct that she shoot everything. And that's how you shoot this kind of shit. Yeah. Man, come over here and fuck with us one time, man. <laughs> you know where we at now. Don't be like that. Well, shit. There you have it, folks. 85 South Show. Yeah. Big Prince. Wow.
We have been waiting. Let's get a photo. Yo. Let's get a bitch. Oh, two seconds. Oh, let me get my glass. One second. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. Oh, that please, though. No. <laughs> <laughs> no, that's what's what's like. That's the other shit. Uh-oh. Get it, get it.